Friendo. Ah, colleagues. DJ. How's it okay. going? Not too bad. I literally just went live. Excellent. Hello, internet. Penis. How did I know you'd say that? I could say vagina instead. Which would you prefer? Is your... uh, you can say whatever the fuck you want. Excellent. Excellent. Uh, perfect, because Mega Man I know. X. I thought you'd pick on that. <laughs> oh, what a... Oh, God. What a fucking masterful video. Uh, you may need to... You may need to reissue that in the general chat, Zero. I know. I know. I was doing it for my phone. <laughs> I was doing it for my phone, so just give me a second here. Ah, uh, okay, yeah, I just noticed that it's it's interesting. It's, it's not a hyperlink. Yeah. yeah, for some reason it does that. So I'm going to adjust it now. I just wanted to have my copy pasta in here. Yeah. Gotcha. There we go. Now it's a link. Hey, big battle. Yo. How it goes? Not much. Just had me my dinner. Nice. Me too. I had curry. I had chicken. I had ravioli. Zero. I fucking forgot. Guess they they had a category for most broken game. Their nominees were Fallout seventy six. <laughs> oh. Nothing else. <laughs> I was about to say. I'm like. So does that mean that we can all get into the dev room? Because that sounds great. The nominees are. Fallout 76. The Fallout winner 76. is Fallout. Uh, yeah. Fallout and the best Not part of the video far. is that section of the video is like fucking glitched out too. Mm. It's, like... <laughs> it's broken. Yep. It sounds about right. Sorry, Sorry that, that wasn't That's supposed it. to happen, it's but wins. but of all things, that is the actual answer. Fallout 76. <laughs> Anybody wondering, he's watching the Easy Allies one? Is that... Yeah, I mean, they just premiered like six seven hours ago because that's how long the deliberations were but now on their stream they're just showing off their edited video so and then they've got personal top my, tens my input on my tv to the actual game <laughs> nearly ready to go here threading that shit around River City Gamers Game of the Year. Good luck. He's like, uh, none of us really played the same games. <laughs> Did you stream today, CJ? No, no, I was out all day. And I oh. worked until, oh gosh, like 2.30, 3 o'clock. Oh, okay. I was just wondering because I didn't see you today. What I got is fucking awesome. Is like I was able to pick up Pearl and Marina from Splatoon 2. Oh, Amiibos. Cool. Oh, I got wow. them. I got them for 20 bucks. Nice. Nice. I just decided to check my local my local store, and they had both of them. They're Japanese versions, but I don't give a shit. Oh. I, I took a picture, but I haven't posted it yet. I picked up, uh, they had one collector's edition of uh, the Toki remake uh, today at EB Games, so I picked that up. For those of you who don't know what Toki is, it is a weird-looking ape man. Who shoots out of his mouth? Okay then. This is popular on the NES and the TurboGrafx-16. Well, popular is a strong word. <laughs> uh, let's see. All right, I think we're good here. Okay. Let me just make sure the stream's still working. It looks like it is. All right. Yes. Mega Man X Legacy Collection 2. I have not played Legacy Collection 2 yet. But we're starting off strong. Is this the... This is PS4, yeah. I was about yeah. to say. Is this PS4? Yeah. I also... Well, I split my brother on the Xbox One version, but it's mostly his console, so it's mostly his game. Um, but, uh, yeah... Uh, we are going to do X5 tonight. And what's nice about this is, for those of you who have seen the X5 playthrough with CJ and I, um, 
This translation is different. Uh, this is more accurate translation. Now, some people are upset about that, but I mean, X Five is uh, a kind of a common game. Yeah, so. but it, it but it confirmed our theory. Yeah, it did confirm our theory, which yeah. you guys will see as I play. So. I love well, this game. So, uh, so what we're saying is, if you want that original experience, you should head over to Zero Master LP uh, <laughs> on YouTube, YouTube. Yeah. and watch this wonderful playthrough with Canadian Jutsu and Zero Master. You're not where... totally shilling that because you're in it, are you? I'm in it, <laughs> but I also tell story. Not the Mr. McDonald's story. Oh, I was supposed to. But that happened in Skyward Sword, was it? I'm fairly sure. Oh, uh, you told your but... stories in X6. I didn't have a story and I next think you body. had a story, but X6 was the one where you shared the story of uh, your when you oh, went to the crackdown. The, 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 the games, no, uh, m yeah. most of your game store stories were from that. Yeah, most of my game store stories. So oh, I have more too. I'm sure you have more that you could share. <laughs> <laughs> um, so for those of you who don't know, this is arguably my favorite in the X series because it it really it it is. It ties in, and it's supposed to be the last in the X series, but of course it wasn't um, because X six got made without the main creation t creative team knowing about it. Um, and and, and, uh, you, and if you may not I know this a is damn like thing about it either. I know this is like a random thing to notice, but I just noticed that all the guys have diapers, but Alia doesn't. Yep. Ladies, they get those sexy hips. So I'm and eventually those uh, round thing is... Yeah, but everybody has everybody has titty. So this game uh, is the first in the series to have auto charge. Have found an X8 um, and rapid fire. So um, they actually would be incorporated in a lot of stuff. I'm gonna keep vibration off because I'm using a controller that doesn't have vibration anyways. Um, but. Uh, but yeah, this is the first game that had auto charge and um, and uh, rapid fire. It they didn't start implementing them into other games until they just started doing re-releases. Okay, so um, there's a benefit to choosing each character. If you choose X first, you'll get the Force Armor from Mega Man X4. Uh, but if you choose Zero, you'll get his Blaster, and the other will have the other one's thing damaged. Um, the Force Armor is relatively more useful than Zero's Blaster, so I'm going to start with X. and But I'll be switching between the characters, because unlike X4, you can switch between characters between stages. So. Basically, Force Armor is X's completed ultimate armor from um, X4, obviously. W well, the ultimate armor is a separate armor in X4. Um, okay. But yeah, you can actually unlock it. Essentially, it's like... His completed armor set from yeah. X4, and while it doesn't have its unlimited um, normal special, n normal um, weapon attacks having unlimited ammo, forgive me, I'm having a little trouble getting my thoughts in the words, it does have special, it does half your special weapon uses. Mm -hmm. so, exactly. It also doesn't contain the Nova Strike. They took that out of the Force Armor in this game. Which it still has the uh, large charge shot as yeah, well. It does have that too, yeah. I mean, it's like it having the Nova Strike would be kind of broken for your armor, even though you have to charge it. But like if like that's why the ultimate armor is a cheat that you can use to get I'm not gonna play this game with the ultimate armor. I'm just gonna play it with uh, I'm gonna get try to get the uh, Falcon and Giga armors. Um I think actually I'm trying to remember, can you unlock the ultimate armor? I think you can actually. Yeah, I think you can. Um, in this wrong. one, well, Probably you can get it the natural code. Way. Yeah, yeah. There's uh, the. But it's not. It's not like X4 where you put in a code on the character yeah. select screen. This one you have to legitimately do it. I'm fairly yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah. Right. There's a capsule in uh, Sigma Stage Three that you can get. You can also yeah. get Black Zero on that, that way. streaming list, Sony. Why did you assholes wake me up? What? We didn't. Uh, we didn't excuse have to me. Get up. You didn't have to yeah. get up. <laughs> I'm messing with you. Calm down. Right. Yeah, I'm messing with you. I'm being an asshole. I just woke up. I mean, that, it's just a regular Tuesday for you in that case. 
And you're not missing much from a uh, SmackDown, if you ask me. Hey, good. I, I can do zero stream then. All right. Hello, guys. Hey, Kirby. I was wondering when you were gonna say something. I did say something when only said he was being an asshole. I just said being. <laughs> I, I didn't. I didn't hear that, but yes. Yeah. Hey, Kirby. I was I I was watching your stream earlier. I didn't interact because. Friggin' what was it, uh, multi chat or whatever, or multi stream. For some reason, the Twitch chat wasn't working. And I'm just gonna quickly turn the. Turn the, uh, uh, the smoothing off because it looks really weird. Yeah, it looks like, it looks like people filled it in with markers. It, it actually, looks really weird. And actually, it looks too sharp the other way. Um, maybe. I'll use a CRT filter. Ah, yeah, that looks good. I like that. What are you, what are you X5. X5. Ooh, this ought to be good. Hey, look on the bright side. It's not X6. I am very familiar with this game, so... I wouldn't worry too much. This was... When I got a PlayStation 1... Um... The second game I got was X5, and my brother got X4 as his second game. Um, and so I played the shit out of this one, because this is my game. Can we talk about the Sigma design in this game? It is probably one of my favorite Sigma oh, designs. Oh yeah, it's so good. Isn't that like, uh, spoilers? Like, we're not even at the final stage of the game yet. Well, well, yeah, well that's... Sigmas. Oh no, I, I Sigma's wanna... in the game. It's also on the wallpaper on the side yeah. here. <laughs> yes! Well, it's like, a, it's like a Mega Man game without Wily. Yeah. His name oh, is no. Professor X. Wink, wink, wink. Oh no, wink. King, is, King is actually starting a rebellion filled with, with a whole bunch of Wily enemies. Don't oh worry. no. It's, it's been a while Gobbler. since I played this game, Good so Gobbler. I'm still trying to get my, my bearings with it. Oh no. Oh no, Gate is doing things. Oh, hey, don't hey, mind. don't you make fun of Gate. Gate is a fine ass man. <laughs> yeah, I'm not saying he, he's like, he, he was a fine ass <laughs> man with a dumb ass plan. <laughs> <laughs> Literally. You, and then your your plan you would be dumb if Sigma like fucking virus the shit out of you. And Sig then even shittier boss fight. I you like Gate's boss fight though. It's I, it's it's hard. <laughs> I find it hilarious that in um in rookie hunter mode they just give it a floor <laughs> and defeat the purpose but you know what funny enough that fight is actually harder with the floor because the platforms are still there so you can gate can easily trap you in a place <laughs> if you don't know how to maneuver oh no zero's buster oh no zero's, zero's partially dead zero's left arm <laughs> Oh no, it's not like we can repair him or anything. They, oh it, wait, yes we well, can. Well, well, it's, I think the story goes they don't have time to fully repair his buster. That's why it doesn't That's why it doesn't get repaired. And if you play this stage of zero, X's force armor gets damaged. And same thing, they don't have time to, to fix it because okay. of the whole Eurasia yeah. thing. Guys, guys, <laughs> you, know what, you, you, know, you want to know what it is? There's yeah. not enough time for zero to hide himself to repair himself. Uh... He, see, he <laughs> needs to die first. Yeah. Hello, I died. I died, but you know, my corpse hid itself and repaired itself. So you oh, know, the funny oh, thing is, like the funny thing seconds. is, though, is the Mega Man Zero cannon doesn't actually have anything to do with X6 through 8. So the actual Mega Man Zero cannon only talks about what happened here in this game. Yeah, this was supposed to be the final X game before, that led up to Zero series, and then Capcom decided, you know what, let's just screw around and hey, eat money. Let's just screw yeah. around and Capcom's make an like, we like money. <laughs> we like money, right? Who Mega doesn't Man's... like money? <laughs> exactly, right? <laughs> yeah, there we go. That's that giant head dead. You're just playing this on normal? Yeah, I'm just playing it on normal. Okay. 
that head. Hey, Zero, do you want to know that I'm upset with you? Why? Okay, remember when you linked the uh, dual play with uh, X6? Mm -hmm. Which is admittedly kind of impressive, because mm -hmm. that game's fucking garbage. But it's still cool he's managing to, like, sync up like that mm -hmm. with one controller. I didn't know the RCG fucking slate thing was Zero's victory thing for that game. Oh, you didn't? No! Shadow Snake <laughs> pointed it out several times. You can tell I didn't pay attention. Is that- he's like, is that Zero's victory thing from X6? I'm like, yep. I don't remember any of that. To be honest, maybe I wasn't there. Speaking of which, I have been working on a new intro slate for RCG, as well as the new design for the website. I don't have anything substantial to show you guys, the members of the site, or anybody who's listening to this yet, but it's being worked on, and uh, I'm, uh, I'm pretty happy with the design so far. What Every the fuck was that? single time. <laughs> That's going on me. Every single time. Okay, we need to hook him up to some sort of like shot collar. <laughs> <laughs> Where it's like you don't forget. Dude, to be fair, he that thing interrupts our private moments too. <laughs> it's like. It's like it's like Eric Andre where they had Jack Black on. They just put this dot, like shot collar on his wrist for lie detector. And they just kept zapping him no matter what. It's like, oh, yeah. <laughs> so, it's, it was nice uh, seeing you guys again. But I yes, am boy. going to go. Yeah, I'm going to go eat dinner. All right. All right. Have a good uh, one, buddy. Yeah. I'll probably so, be watching still though. I. So for the unexplained people who don't know what's going on in the story apparently sigma's fight apparently sigma's giant head had a huge amount of viruses in it well, and I'm a it has head. not only affected the <laughs> entire world but a colony that is about to drop onto the earth yeah oh wait i missed what his name like, was ah uh, tidal whale he'll always be duff mcwhale in my heart yeah uh, well yeah Volt Kraken, anyway. that's better than Squid Adler, to be honest. Say for sure. Shining Firefly. Izzy Glow yeah. kind of worked, though. I was okay with that. Guns yeah, of course. <laughs> okay, I mean, so. Yeah, they Volt, all got changed uh, in the. Volt room. Kraken is a really cool fucking name. Though. That is a really cool name, yeah. Uh, I will say um, that. Uh, so. Just going on what Big Battle was saying is uh, you've got a certain amount of time to uh, defeat the Robot Masters. Now, you can cheese this game because it is a certain level of R&D. You can literally beat the first level and launch, uh, the, launch the Enigma and launch the Space Shuttle right at the start of the game. And there's a, ch a percentage that you will uh, be successful and unlock the final stages right, right away. Um, that's what speedrunners do in this game, uh, if it's an any percent run. Um, but uh, usually, what happens to me is we're gonna we're gonna see if this happens. Usually, the Enigma fails, uh, and the shuttle is successful. That's usually what happens to me, and usually and because it's also the canon ending of this game. Yeah. So usually, what the reason for that is usually my pattern is Grizzly Slash. Um, Duff McWhale, and I'm, these are just the names I grew up with, so these ones I remember. Uh, Volt Kraken, I remember that one because it's cool, and Izzy Glow is my order. And then when the Enigma fails, I go back to one of these guys' stages to get the armor part in this. Because all the armor parts are pretty easy to get in this game, except one of them require in, uh, uh, Duff McWhalen's Tidal stage. Whales. Whatever, it requires a, a weapon from another uh, Maverick, so uh, you almost have to backtrack if you want to get the armor. And you're going to want to get the Falcon Armor. The Falcon Armor is really useful in this game. Um, so anyways, let's just start off with uh, uh, Grizzly Slash or Slash Beast or whatever the heck he's using. He's not Slash Beast, that's X4. That's Grizzly. Oh, and uh, for the unaware, 
Uh, this time, you can't just grab the armor piece and immediately equip. You have to collect all four armor pieces this because apparently the uh, viruses have made it so putting them on in the site is not a good idea. Well, oh, well, I always thought, and like, it said in the Dr. Light uh, capsules that it was just a security measure. Yeah, because of all the Sigma virus scenario, Sigma virus going on. Of course, they do the same damn thing in X6, which makes me wonder, okay, there's no viruses going on here. What the hell, man? Well, Sigma and Zero are really just virus constructs. Like, that's what they're designed and purpose to be. Because when <laughs> Sigma shed his original Reploid body, he became a virus. And technically, Zero is too, because his code is what made the Sigma virus. Still. The, the idea was to corrupt any any attempt at creating um, artificial life. But still, the, the several weeks have passed when X6 comes into play. You don't. You're trying to tell me they haven't gotten rid of the whole virus problem um, by then? It's not that simple. It's like saying, oh, well, we have computers now. We should be able to get rid of all viruses. The, the thing is, is because these robots most likely have proper artificial intelligence, that I, I don't think that they're able to follow... So for anybody who on. is following there, sorry to interrupt you, CJ, that is how oh, no, you get... That is how you get the sub tank. You have to get it before that one truck explodes. Anyways, continue what you were saying. Oh, I was just saying that like it, it's not unplausible that they be their code is like able to rewrite itself. Uh, so there's no proper defense against the virus. Like people were going maverick way before they understood why. Oh, oh Mega Man, uh, and once that again. happened. That virus is You can put it together later like a puzzle. And then you could get the super cool armor that turns you into a falcon. And then we'll do this all over again in X6. Even though there shouldn't be in a X7, Sigma virus problem. In X8. And Command. I don't know if it happens in Command Mission. But. Now, Command Mission's RPG. So we can't have armor? No, but you can grab an ultimate armor after beating a super boss or right. something like that. So if anybody's wondering, um, the heart was in an early part of the stage, but it, re it doesn't require the Gaia armor, but it's just way easier to get it with the Gaia armor, so I'm going to come back for that. Um, I will have to backtrack at some point, but I'm going to backtrack when I don't have a time limit. Uh, because it, that way I can get all the stuff that I missed without having to worry about, you know, the earth being destroyed. Because you only have 16, uh, you only have 16 tries, uh, in total. 16 hours, 16 tries, because an hour passes every time you, you, uh, finish a stage or exit a stage and choose another one. Uh, so, um... You have to you have to be kind of uh, conservative with stuff that you get early on, um, and just go back and get stuff later. Yeah, visually slash is pretty easy, uh, probably the easiest of the bosses. Of course, I'm doing terrible against them right now. Also, this is the first game where the bosses have levels. If you're playing on easy, every boss is level 1. Uh, and depending on how much of the game you've progressed, they'll have different health and different strength. So right now, Grizzly Slash is level... I think I can't tell if it's 1 or 7. It's hard to tell. It's level 1. Yeah, so his health is less and his strength is less. But honestly, he's probably the place you want to start. Because his pattern's pretty easy. I... 
never quite understood how this thing, how this whole leveling system works. The only thing I do know is that it's related to parts that you get into the game. I think it's also related to the progression as well. I'm, I'm not 100% sure. Not sure. Not sure. I think progression is like dead set the moment you boot up a uh, run of the game and uh, stuff. I'm not 100% sure if it's 100% and locked once you get the final part for either the Enigma or the Shuttle. So this is also the first game in the X series where you get a rank based on how well you did. Um, so. Uh, I'm at rank A right now. Uh, X starts at rank B, and I believe Zero starts at rank S A. So I think it goes up to M M H or M H H. I can't remember what they call it. That's basically uh, a rank for. I think it's. I forget what it is for exactly. But usually I don't get higher than G A. But that's average. So I might be getting that cross too. I think M M H might also be in. Uh, X6, but basically it goes, you know, D, C, B, A, S, A, G, A, and then whatever is above that. Um, so X always starts as rank B in this game, and Zero starts as rank S, A, like I said before, so... I don't get how a crystal ball is supposed to, like... I mean, how big is this crystal ball is? Well, is, uh, anyway. I would assume I assume it's a it's a reflector of some sort. It's used to charge up the machine. Yeah, because it's like a laser. Uh, so so. It's like yeah, one of those large um, focusing lens. So here's this game's rival character. I don't know if you call him a rival or what, but uh, Dynamo. He's just kind of this pretty boy who shows up and likes to annoy the Maverick Hunters. That's apparently his goal in life. I think I'm... Now, he's more of a annoyance than rival. Though he does show up in X6, so... Yeah. What do I know? Alright, so now that I've defeated uh, Gri uh, Grizzly Slash, or Crescent Grizzly, I'm gonna go after Tidal Whale. Yeah, I remember this time. And for this one, we're gonna go ahead and choose X again. I will choose zero, I promise. I just want to, um, I'm just trying to get some upgrades for X first. And unlike uh, other games, I don't know, unlike other games, since you have a choice between characters, things like hearts are progressive. So, like, uh, X, if you get a heart with X, you only get it with X, and vice versa. But, you can, if you get a high enough rank in a stage, you can earn life ups or hearts. Uh, as well, so you, a character won't be 100% gimped if you don't get um, the heart, uh, all the hearts. So, of course, if your RNG, as far as the ending is concerned, is absolute shit, you won't be able to use zero for the final stages. Yeah. There we go. Actually, been a couple I, a couple years since I played this game. I used to play this game all the time. I was never really a Mega Man fan, nor an X fan. I mean, the only X game I ever played was the original Mega Man X from the X Collection on the PS2, and I only got it as far as uh, the. The uh, chill penguin boss fight after, and I lost all my lives to him. I was like, no, I'm not doing this. Somebody who hasn't played these games, you sure know a lot about them. I see a lot of play food, play foods of these sort of games. So. Yeah. I may, not, I may not play them, but that doesn't mean I don't keep track of them every now and again. Yeah, that's true. There's games I definitely haven't played through that I know a lot about. So, this thing, just to explain what this is, this is the mini-boss. 
uh, of the stage, you're going to have to fight three phases. Um, and each one you have to get through a bit of the stage before you can actually get to the fight. And it has a health bar. Luckily, what's nice about the uh, the force armor is that uh, charge shot kind of stays there and does additional damage. Oh, I jumped at the wrong time. One thing I do like about this game is when you do use something like that, it shows you how much damage uh, it, they took. Like it shows like a red bar to show how much like. And just for a split second, it does help. Yeah. So when you're using stuff like this, Charge Blast, you can actually see how much it's doing uh, fairly easily. Because especially with the game, because with the game where they switch to an energy bar instead of a uh, a bar with like uh, pellets or meters in them, it's a lot harder to tell uh, where you're at with health or how much damage you've done and all that stuff. It might also be. <coughs> Oh, the Netta X game, but doesn't this game also have like a counter for how many uses of special weapon energy you have left? Uh, I think uh, it depends. Some, uh, I think some weapons do. I think actually this game does do that. I'm trying to remember, it's, it's been that long. I mean, you can always switch over to yeah. Grizzly Slash's weapon. Oh yeah, it does show you. Yeah. No. this part of the fight the most annoying. You can slightly see your point on that. I mean, those missile tubes are not exactly giving you any favors. There we go. So there's one more mini-boss fight against this thing. Um, but we actually get a different part of the stage for once. I just like doing that. <laughs> okay. Joy, we get to play on a different part of the stage while we fight the same boss. Alright, so... Imagine my stun shocked. So, there is another heart that you really need, the Gaia armor or the, uh... Um... Or the, uh... What's the word? I don't know... Actually, I can't remember the heart of the tank, but it's one of the items you need. Uh, the guy armor, or be really good with the uh, falcon armor to get. Because uh, there's just a wall of spikes that you have to get past. That right up here. Like crap. Yeah. And this is another reason why we gotta backtrack, because we've gotta get a weapon, Squid Adler's weapon, so we can get through this door. Um. Or no, I'm not behind, Squid Adler's so... weapon. It's uh, you... the whale's weapon, because there's a bomb right there, and we can only get up yeah. by getting into that. So yeah, that yeah, that's Duffman Rails Duff's weapon that you need. Yeah. So the final form of this mini boss. This one's pretty annoying too. Dodging those little laser beams would be a pain in the ass. Again, it could be worse. You could be playing X6 and be playing Blaze Heatnet's stage. I mean, his stage isn't that bad. Had to fight a donut robot at least four times. Yeah. Though, if I compared the two, I would take the donut robot over this thing. Oh, one thing I forgot to mention: the uh, the the blowfish. Enemies from Mega Man X1 are back in uh, all their 32 bit glory this time. Uh, let's see. Okay. 
Yeah, maybe that's not to take too much damage, but luckily the force armor does uh, retain its uh, defense abilities. This fight, you want to be really careful. You don't want to stay near the bottom before you do this part of the mini boss because uh, it will drag you down. <laughs> oh, it's one of those kind of bosses. Yeah. Oh, free life! Free life! <laughs> I saw free life and I went for it. <laughs> I'm probably going to lose here because I'm low on health. Fine. You, you, you're not gonna. That's why I got it for you, life. Okay. Oh, I did it. <laughs> Somehow. Yeah, you forgive me. I'm a little. I'm behind, so. No, that's fine. Oh, okay. So. Definitely this first life is the, uh, the throwaway life, because, uh... Yeah, you are not in good standing to fight stuff. I'm kind of interested to see what he says now. Good old Duff McWhalen being like, you can't use my water. <laughs> Next, an X for a change of pace is like, fine, I'll just fight you for your water then. X is more like, if you're not gonna give me any choice, then I guess I have no choice. I gotta fight you for the water. Because I have auto charge on, this doesn't charge up, but you can charge this up. Press the wrong button. I got that special weapon is on triangle in this game. Don't mind me, I'm gonna hunt for a hair cross. Oh, plants Pokemon are you? I'm uh, paying heart gold, and I'm trying to get a hair across. <laughs> Good luck. Yeah, it's it's a pain in the ass. I've like done it, uh, uh, hit hit butted the same fucking tree for like a hundred over a hundred times. And all you've been getting are pine cones. That no, I've been getting spiros and monkeys. That's all I've been getting. <laughs> there is nothing wrong with Mankey. <laughs> no, 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 not Mankey. Apom. Oh. Conniving real shit. <laughs> I know, I did. <laughs> no, I'm trying to find, like, the freaking weapon killer to face Whitney, because I do not want to fight that milk tank. No, uh-uh. Just use the Mankey, it has low kick. I don't have a Mankey! It's an A-Palm! <laughs> oh. Crap. Okay, so because I did good enough uh, on the stage, I can choose if I want to upgrade my weapons and life, weapons and energy. If you go for life, you basically get uh, a free heart. So I'm going to go for that. And I'm guessing energy means you get to use your special weapons more. I think, yeah, it increases the ability of this uh, of that. But I don't. I actually don't use special weapons a ton in this game, so I find life a lot more useful. But uh, especially since the hearts are split split up between two characters, if, you know, I get to keep both characters, we'll find out uh, as time goes on. Oh, great. Dynamo's here to waste our time. Ah, uh, joy. 
Hi there! X? Hi there! I'm here to ruin your day! Should I fight him as Zero? Because I haven't played as Zero yet. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Are you good enough to... Are you good enough to cheese him as Zero? Well, his name is Zero Master, so I don't hope so. I should, yeah, I should hope that I am. <laughs> <laughs> Dynamo's not too tough in this game. The master of nothing. But you know, he's pretty good at the Mega Man's, you know. I like the Mega Man, anyways. <laughs> I just want to disturb you, but you want to <laughs> fight to the death. Put the words right out of my mouth. Yeah, Dynamo's not too tough. Especially with Zero with his <laughs> Kuenbu. Flip Flash. Flip Flash. He's already days. dead. Of course, you can always try dash canceling your first slash. That also works, but. It didn't count. I'm not hurt. I'm leaving. <laughs> And that got zero to rank GA. That was fast. <laughs> Damn. And I think the higher your rank, too, the more likely you are to get the benefits. So X is definitely one I'm going to want to rank up because he's still at A. That also means the higher your rank, the more powerful your bosses are going to get. That's true. But... Uh, the only one I really have trouble with when the, uh, is, um, uh, I forget what, the, what he's called in this one, but, uh, Matrax, he's the, he's the fire T-Rex guy. I just always find him a pain in the ass. So let's see, I've got to pick one of his weapons, so, I don't know, is that Squid Adler that I use it on? I think hmm. it's Duffman Rails McRail. Stuff's weapon that you need for that um, life castle in his stage. But Squid Adler's little um, thing is a crap. Is a crap shoot and a half. Hmm. It's crack. Oh my god, that's terrible. Crap shoot. I know what you said. <laughs> I'm just being a dick. Speaking of dicks, where's Oni? That's a good question. Did he fall asleep? Yeah, oh, he fell back asleep. Oh. Alright, he's watching SmackDown. Oh, for God's sakes. Is he, though? I, I thought he, sw I thought he swore off, off that. I kind of broke him. Oh, wait, that was me. Okay, let me just check again. So... Yeah, but... He went back because he's trying to give it one last chance. Yeah, it is Squid Adler. Yeah, and he's, he's coming to regret that decision, especially after last night. Five out of ten on Raw. Not enough for me to grab the purge gifts, but still bad. Dean lost his title. Zero out of ten. There, that's all I will say. Okay. Hunting for that hair cross. Hmm. Okay. Okay. So I can't get any of that stuff right now. So, but Squid Adler's next. So, oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Hope your reflexes are good. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> there is no way that I can be worse than some people. 
I expect a world record quality speed run by next week, Zero. Fuck. <laughs> I, <already laughs> I am setting a very high oh, bar. Oh man, this might be a little different with the lag, because there is also lag in this version. Ah, fuck. Yeah, uh, and oh, you yeah. have to collect all those um, orbs yep. to grab something. Yep, I sure do. I don't get the armor oh, part if and, I do. Uh, by the way, uh, that ready screen. You have to jump immediately mm -hmm. before it disappears. Otherwise, uh, you're dead. Oh, that sucks. Ah, shit. Yeah, I don't like saying this, but it is kind of a beginner's trap. Oh, no, I got them all. I screwed up at the end. Oh, uh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Shit. Oh, oh, okay. Hear that, Blondie? We made a JoJo oh. rep right. He's not here. I know yeah, that that person. Well, he could be watching. I know yeah, what that is. <laughs> and I know that he's a Joe star. <laughs> Yes, yes. Did you yes. like any of the new moments and characters? Ah. No! <laughs> no! I love. I, would, I like that! I love Red Letter Media. Oh, where's Unreal with his, uh, with his rich line? Star Destroyers! I'm gonna come! Ah. I screwed up. This... God, I love that. I've been recently been watching uh, Red Letter Media compilations online. Uh, there's this one where of uh, the one guy Rich, the high pitched guy. Um, every time he he mispronounces things, <laughs> it's like thirty minutes long. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> it's so good though. Yeah, I mean it's a little bit different. Like when somebody's just rambling on and they're used to calling something something. They've but also been when, drinking at the same time. Yeah, but when someone, like, has video footage of a character's name being pronounced correctly, and then they proceed to constantly call them something not, it's just, yeah. it, it bothers the shit out of me. Likewise. You, you, you know what what uh, what does bother me sometimes, and this is something. This is nothing against uh, the gaming historian, but this happened in his new video. It's not out yet, but it's coming out. He talks about. He says uh, the. Um, he says the. Uh, uh, the uh, pronunciation of the Japanese word that gave Wario his name, and he he starts calling it Wario. It's Wari. The Japanese word for. Uh, bad or evil and then he says he, he, he starts calling him so wari and mario morio oh, what no, no, no. Mario. <laughs> i call him morio sometimes i i'll admit that but like if you're gonna use the word right after it <laughs> come on it's because they rhyme but i didn't make them rhyme <laughs> Oh yeah, I got them all. Boot. That took less than half the time I expected. I was about to say, I'm like, that that was probably a big record, because in our Let's Play, you didn't do it very well. Pretty sure it was half the episode <laughs> when we did uh, that. I think you failed more at Jet Stingray, right though. Hello, are you alright? No, I'm not alright. I died several times trying to grab all the orbs. Well, you didn't die enough. More death. <laughs> I demand more sacrifice Man, of you just, robot flesh. You're just very demanding these days. <laughs> <laughs> First it's more bits, now it's more death. More bit. Are you in your pure fortune? He needs more bits. <laughs> I wonder what's inside. Don't Man, he came over to my stream and he showered me with more bits. He knew what was happening. How, how much do you want to bet that? To see if caught... Oh, it's just a light castle. Never mind. How, how much do you want to bet that Pure Fortune is just like a secret, like, sugar daddy yeah. or something? 
He's just a billionaire that's just like, I'm gonna take pity on these guys. I like these weird Canadians. Uh, yeah. <laughs> they make butt jokes. <laughs> so this stage's gimmick is you gotta shoot the little switches in. Uh, yes. Actually pretty annoying, especially in later parts of the stage, but hey, it's a gimmick. Now imagine doing this with Zero. I have. <laughs> it, uh, it's not fun. The main thing you want to do in these sections is just get rid of the enemies, because they're just going to be in your way. Isn't that, like, a general thing to do anyway? Also, saving um, Reploids can earn you life up as well. So, you're going to want to try and save as many of them as you can. They're just free health and possibly free yeah. one-ups. More so in uh, X6. Um, well, they always give free one-ups as long as your health's not left that low. Yeah, and then X6 there, basically the uh, main source of your parts. Pretty Especially much. if you need something ah, very vital. I screwed this up. You mean like certain part. chips that require that you require to beat the game? <laughs> to a certain extent. You can still beat it without most of the chips, but there are some that just make that game so much easier. Yeah. This door's kind of annoying. <sighs> I can see. It's probably more annoying if you had to play a zero. It's actually not terrible as zero. Would I prefer to do it as zero? No. <laughs> and that one gave me a free life and gave me some health. I mean, they just always give you free lives. I don't know. No, that one I think my they're right just out. like help pick up or free life. I don't know if it's random or if it's like. Determine. Okay, so this one's the worst. This one's the worst door because there's spikes on the ground. Oh joy! Yay! Spike, Spike and door puzzle, my favorite. Luckily, I got through that one pretty quick, though. Zero, you're not supposed to shoot the people you're supposed to rescue. Psh. Oh. My I bullets kill them. <laughs> That's why I play Ana. Overwatch. <laughs> <laughs> when you want to play a healer, but you really want to murder your teammates. Alright, so... I'm not gonna be able to get this, but I'll just show this real quick. So... This right here, you need the guy armor for because of the uh, the buster can break those blocks, and also because spikes. Um, so I won't be able to utilize that yet, unfortunately. But I figured I'd show you guys it real quick. Come on, door! Come on! Ah, damn it! Stupid jet boots. Stupid things. Stupid game changers. You make me look bad. <laughs> ah, damn it! And yeah, they totally don't look cool at all. Either that, we just have bad taste. <laughs> <laughs> no, get up! Ah, did it. Okay. And I jet booted through the door. Isn't key. Boot. 
Please, Mr. Dragon, leave me alone. What are you playing? Oh, 14. Blue Mage came out today. Oh, okay. Pretty sweet. How is it? I am quite enjoying Blue Mage. It's a different type of class, which this game is kind of needed. They've needed, I guess, more gimmicks, I guess, with some of the, the things, because the rotations are great with each class, but having to actually fight against proper monsters and learn their abilities is really, really fun. Yep, and there we go. This is the screen I was talking about. I'm sorry about Launch Octopus. Yeah, there it is. Uh, the, the, the line we were, we were so confused about. We were like, wait. Oh, Octoparo? Octoparo? Is that yeah. Launch Octopus? <laughs> Launch Octopus. Why does that name sound so? Uh, it's from X One. Yeah. yeah, that was his brother, which is weird because one was an octopus and one was a squid. They don't share relation, other than the fact that they live in the sea. Who lives in a pineapple under the sea? No. <laughs> no. no, we're not doing that. Joke. Oh my God, he's alive. Yay! Oni, Oni, you've come back to us. I was we were so worried. You were not worried. Oh, and I found were you my watching magic wrestling? Sword. I'm here across. No, I was actually putting DVDs in a, DVDs in a box to sell. Were they wrestling DVDs? Somewhat, yes. Ah, so there was related. You're half right, dear. You're half right. <laughs> I need money. That's fine. He likes DVDs anyway. Yeah, who watches DVDs anymore? Everybody watches. I have, I have a bunch of TV series that are on DVD still. Yeah, me too. Like Clone so High everybody and Undergrad. Netflix until they start raising the prices on that. <laughs> Round two, Volt Kraken. Slash Squid Wait, Adler. Why didn't you use this in round one? Slash, uh, because my health wasn't max. I have this thing in, in Mega Man X where I don't use the weapons unless my health, health is max. Because if I die, then I could have wasted the weapon. This is Mega Man X where when you hit someone with a weakness, they just repeat their pattern. Oh, I'm going to go no, 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 no. Oh, I'm going to go right. Not always. But that's how it usually works. <laughs> I like how he summons this really, really intimidating block. He's like, look, you shall fall for my evil block, Mega Man. Oh, Wait, look, he made a block that I could step on. <laughs> but there's electricity coming out of it. I probably <laughs> shouldn't step on it. Eh. I'll just oh no, I stepped on it! On it. <laughs> Speed strats! Alright, got the life and got a life thing again. So, here we go. Alright. So. Most of the life stuff is going to X at this point, because, I'm going to be honest, I mostly use X in this game, <laughs> but... That doesn't mean I won't get stuff for zero. It's just, uh... Now, I'm trying to remember what you need to get the, uh... I think you need zero for, uh... to get the armor piece in this stage, so... I may switch to him. Yeah, well, you don't need it, but, um, Zero hasn't gotten much, uh... Oh, I was like, did I, did my stream freeze? But no, it's just there's no moving parts on the main menu. Yeah. There's Ooh, just there's nothing no blinking or moving. That's so weird. I didn't know it was a stagnant yeah. image. So I'm gonna use Zero for the stage. I love this stage's music, by the way.
This game in general has really good music. I love its mix of like synth and guitar stuff. So I don't mm, think you I think can get this hard. Good chunk of the X zero. music once you get to around like no, four or five starts to get really good. Yeah, you can't double jump and use dash in this game. So I won't be able to get the heart at zero, unfortunately. Now you, oh, now you gotta what? Now you gotta do this uh, stage as him because I'm pretty sure if you leave your yeah your timer ticks down by one. But that's okay. I'm gonna have to go back to the stage anyway. Because you have to get, uh, that's, the fire, you need the fire for, to get the heart in this stage, so. I'm gonna have to, or the energy tank, so. I'm gonna have you to come back. Bio armor? No. You need the fire you to sure? get the tank. Because it's, like, right under a pit of spikes. No, I'm, I mess up, not the heart, oh, the oh, energy oh, tank. Oh, oh, I'm seeing it now. You yeah. need the fire thing to get rid of the yeah. wooden Yeah, so I'm gonna have to come back here anyways. Stage definitely, ha definitely has a very Castlevania vibe to it. So one thing to note here um, is that uh, the Sigma virus strengthens zero while it, uh, I believe it uh, does, I forget what it does to X exactly. Basically, um, with X, you want to avoid those Sigma viruses because if you take too many, they'll start to take damage over time. But as zero, if you take too many um, Sigma viruses, you'll recover HP over time, and I think you'll become invulnerable for a short period, yeah. or at least become at least hit harder. In other words, um, Sigma's viruses are helpful for zero. Ah, shit. Knew that was gonna happen. I shouldn't have went for it. Excuse me. <laughs> Much to drink. Ah, damn it. I didn't double jump fast enough. <laughs> All those extra lives I got are gonna be gone fairly quickly at this rate. At least you have unlimited continues. Yeah. But even then, they're kind of limited in terms of where you need to go. Oh, wait a minute, no, because they don't count the hours when you... Yeah, if you, con if you continue the same stage, you don't lose an hour. It's only yeah, if I... you switch stages or complete a stage. I I had a dumbass moment. Why did this double jump not work there? Okay, that was an input problem, because I pressed it. And it didn't do it. Yeah, I don't know what happened. There's a moment. Yeah, there's still a delay. At least this version looks really good. I'll just air dash. Fuck it, when in doubt, air dash. Might as well. Sigma virus was like, give me a hug, zero. I just wanna hug you. So he doesn't have the, he doesn't have the Z-Buster, right? No, because oh. I 
it got damaged in the intro stage. And X won't have his fourth armor if Zero was chosen first. Mm -hmm. This is what I meant to do last. Alright, in the second phase of the level, finally. One thing I should mention as well is that, uh, oh, I should get these, because they're be beneficial. Is I believe uh, Zero's uh, upgraded saber, uh, the purple one, once you get it, uh, can cut the, uh, the Sigma viruses. Finally cut that damn thing! This mini boss is kind of a pain in the ass. It's it's fine yeah, if the it. thank God. It's <laughs> fine if the gun you need to cut ends up going to the bottom of the stage because then it's very easy to do. But sometimes it goes to the top, and that's no good. Like this isn't too bad either because at least I could stand on that other gun. I thought the purple Z saber upgrade was to take care of projectiles. It can do that as well. Ah, shit, I still got hit by that laser. A lot less health than I like to have at this point, but... My, the pattern isn't too bad that I'm getting, so... There we go. Alright, so... This is the last section of the stage. And these things can be destroyed with either the C shot or uh, Zero's uh, spinning slash. And one of these you have to cut because that's where the armor piece is. So we should be revealing that soon. I'm trying to remember which one it was exactly. Might be this one. We'll just cut every last one of them. Pretty much. That, <laughs> that's pretty much my uh, my plan. Oh, it's this one up here. <coughs> of course, the obvious one is the one that I have to cut. Here we go. So that's the third piece of the Falcon armor. One left. One left to go. And they are... They're gonna be a pain in the butt. What, the Falcon armor? No. No, no! Getting that last piece! I just have to go back to Duff McRowan's stage. Oh. You can do two-thirds of that, uh... That submarine boss fight. Yeah, that's true, but it's not that bad. It's just long, that's the problem with it. Alright, so now I'm in caution. Uh, and now I'm in danger. So for X this would be bad, but because I'm zero, it's good. And because you're regaining HP and... Yeah. I had heard it has a slight, uh, uh, a slight, um, uh, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? It has a, uh, a slight percentage on the plot, but, but it's, it's very minimal, so you can still, it's still RNG, basically. You'd have to, like, you'd have to well, get it a lot. That way, RNG in this game. So, alright, so this is the last of the bosses that has a piece of the Enigma. So I've done all the bot. Uh, this is going to be all the bosses on the left-hand side, and on the right-hand side of the pieces for the shuttle. So, the game and the four bosses are weak against each other, so the, the game basically tells you, fight these bosses first. Basically, it just pushes you to the Enigma cannon, because... Mm -hmm. 
if you manage to destroy the colony with it, Zero doesn't have to go on his suicide run with the shuttle. Now, the shuttle doesn't always result in him dying as well. That's the other thing, too. Most of the time when I do it, it he doesn't. So, we're, we're about to find out what this playthrough does, though, because I'm streaming and it's streamer's luck, right? Yeah. Provided you can take care of this boss. Well, he's dead now. Ah, stream lag. He's dead because that's why. <laughs> Alright. Ah, uh, Zero got bumped down to SA. I figured that would happen. You got too slow there, Zero. We're bumping you down a rank. You're but too slow. I got the life up plus, which is nice. So that'll give me uh, uh, an even bigger heart, which is something Zero needs. So he gets a bigger life increase, which is nice because Zero hasn't gotten any of the hearts yet. <laughs> All right, so. All right, guys, we're finally going to fire the Enigma. So let's see what happens. Pray to R and Jesus. Pr hashtag pray to R and Jesus. <laughs> I always found it weird that he said blast off for a laser beam. Okay, <laughs> Cygnus. And, oh, we didn't do it. Hell yeah. As I expected. Oh. You, I've got, I've played this game so many times I can tell from the first image whether it did it or not. So because if I, it goes, if it goes through the space station, that means mm -hmm. that it succeeded, right? Yeah, it. Uh, I think it, that's what that is. It merely yeah. pushed it, so it added an hour to our timer, which I'm going to it use for that tracing. Jack all to the timer. It adds an hour, actually. Sure, because I'm yep. pretty sure it doesn't. Alia do actually just explained that in the in the text. Um, so it adds an hour to the time. That's all it really does, unfortunately. Um, considering I played X5 two times, one in normal, one in rookie hunter mode. Do you mind if I um add a little tidbit to this? Shoot. In Rookie Hunter mode, you know when you have, like, extra lives, you get up to nine? Mm -hmm. The Enigma Cannon always hits. It doesn't just, like, hit it and push it back an hour. It goes through. Really? Yeah. So, basically, if you have nine lives when you're in, your, when you're in Rookie Hunter mode, it's basically a guaranteed chance for the Enigma to destroy the colony. All right. Bingo. So we've been explained the other four Mavericks, but I'm actually going to go back, like I said, to um, Duff McWhalen stage and go back with X. See, yeah, it added an it added another hour to it because when I went to Dizzy stage, it lowered it down to 11, and now it's back down to 11 again. So, um, Hi, Macaweed. Ah, Kirby's back. Yeah, I, I had pizza. I, I fired the Enigma. Can you guess what happened? It, and I fired again. And it missed. And it, I fired <laughs> and I missed. I missed again. <laughs> I had a popsicle. No, we hit it. I passed it, out. We just pushed. We just didn't destroy it. We just pushed it. I swear to God, they patched it out. They they, they patched out the high percentage it out. Because, um... Uh, I'm not sure if you. If, I know probably a people, a lot of people heard of this uh, this YouTuber named So Call Me Johnny. Yeah. yeah. When he did the review of the X Collection, so like that, you could uh, on Rookie Hunter mode. Yeah. Launch it and get the highest percentage you can, which I think was like 100% destroyed easily. But I think they patched it out, so now you could the highest you can ever get, even in Rookie Hunter mode, is like uh, 68%. Oh, really? Wait, yeah. what? Which is still to RNG levels, like, let's just flip a coin. 
Oh, so they patched out that. Okay. Yeah. Fuck. Bastard. See, the interesting thing is, I didn't have an update when I installed this, so... Maybe it's, like, an on-disc patch, or... Or maybe it comes with the... You get the update when you install the game now. I don't know. So, uh... I need to I need to finish my videos. I have like three videos that I'm sitting on right now. Dude, tell me about it. I've written like three scripts. <laughs> and I'm sure that there are other completed scripts from like ages and ages ago that haven't seen the light of day, because I got some of those on my system. Well, you know what? No matter no matter how bad we procrastinate, you will never be as bad as my friend Zio. Okay? Or what John Tron. Or, Actually, John Tron. This, or John Tron. Or he, <laughs> he is the standard that I will I want to strive to be above. Okay. If okay, he's so... posting more shit than I am every year, I really need to review myself and check myself. Okay, no no no. Let me tell you let me tell you a story about Zio, okay? I met this dude years ago, Zio Lightning. He has I think four thousand subs now. I don't know. I met him years ago. He he's a good he's a good guy. We played a lot of Pokemon and Yu-Gi-Oh! It was fine. Another, but he's he's a, another YouTuber. He started Paper Mario as a Let's Play. July seventh, two thousand eight. Oh, my birthday. And he is now making another part for it. It's been almost a decade. What the hell? Jesus! <laughs> Not that I procrastinated. Fuck. To be Sad, fair, I still. I <laughs> to be fair, I still need to finish Dragon Quest Swords. And uh, the, only reason, um, the only reason. Um, that there is another finish. thing in this room that needs to be finished, Zero. If it's Emerald, it's never happened. <laughs> I, lo I you, lost the day. Your very first Let's Play. No, my very first <laughs> Let's Play was Mega Man X. I know, but on your Let's Play channel. Don't worry, I'm gonna do something special for that. All right. I want Christopher walking back. I that was, was, I was uh, that was uh, Fire Red, actually. <laughs> oh, that was the Fire Red one. Oh. Yeah. And um, that was. This is why I'm so lost in the Pokemon Emerald Let's Play. You need to refresh my memory, man, by bringing more parts out. Uh, no. It was July. I have an idea for that. 2010. But it, it's, it's, oh, it's getting there. It's getting there to the point where I'm just like, make another part. And he messaged me the other day talking about, well, I got to do this part where I got to complete uh, all the tasty recipes and stuff like that. And I was just like... Oh, I didn't bother with that shit. <laughs> I, he's 100%ing it. So, that's fine. God, when I'm did I like, Let's Play Paper Mario? In the first that, year that I was, started That was your first year. That was your first year of Let's Play. Well, I, know, I, I know that for a fact. Well, I can it tell you what one because I remember finished. it's in your one year anniversary. Right. I am doing terrible against this thing. No. There we go. I still beat it though with one health left. But um, I it a little too close there. I've been I've been writing scripts called a, a, a script. I can English. I've been writing scripts called uh, what am I playing? And I talk about like. Oh just uh like mmos or at all uh mobile games that i've been playing i have like three scripts written out and i'm working on a fourth script. the hard thing is like getting the getting the right footage for recording it like i can make a video like just grab the, like trailer footage off youtube and just make a video any schmuck can do that but i'm making it personal you know how is your how is the color splash going by the way Oh my god, I'm having so much fun, but like, this game is gonna be long, oh my god. Okay. Are we talking like, me playing Breath of the Wild long? Cause I'm, I'm actually starting to be like, man, I am taking forever to do shit. <laughs> um, okay, <laughs> let, me, let, let, let me put it this way. Um, I'm 100%ing it too. A, a color splash. Okay. I've done two sessions of record, um, streaming so far. And that's what I equated to like, five hours. I just got the first, um... Um, so big pink star. So oh, okay. I think he could have charged charge the goose shaver to uh, make it a little easier to hit that button. 
Yeah, I know, but uh, I have, I have auto charge on, so it doesn't exactly work. <laughs> but now I've completed the Falcon armor. Bam, bam. Now we have a broken game. So, yeah, no, it's it's gonna take me a while. Um, the game, the game, um, is massive. Like each each little node on the on the map select has at least five to six ma um, maps within it. So it's it's pretty big. It's gonna be it's probably gonna be the longest thing I've ever streamed, um, bar none. Easily like for just for a Paper Mario game, easily like eighty to hundred hours, especially since I'm hundred percenting it. Well, it's good to hear that you're enjoying it. It means it's probably not complete trash like uh, Sticker Star like, was. I never got around to playing Sticker Star, so I don't know how different different it is. But like, hey, it's bad. The 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 whole thing with the hammer scraps and stuff like that. That is technically speaking, like your experience and your levels and stuff like that. And oh, I got a trophy. Get, and when you do get a big paint star, they up your um your HP. You start off at 50, now I have 75. And um, I didn't know this, and someone had to tell me, once you start getting big paint stars, enemies in earlier areas, if you first strike them, they just instantly die. So I didn't even know that was a thing. So, pretty much a, you dare bring light to my lair, you must die thing. Pose. I don't think anyone here is going to ever play Wand of Gamelon, so... Uh, <laughs> I thought it was uh, Mask uh, of um, Evil. <laughs> Mask of Evil. My bad, I, like, I don't know my Zelda CDIs as much as I know my, you know, actual good Zelda games. Well, uh, there's, there's at least like one person who's beaten uh, Wand of Gamelon here. Whoa, well, was it you? No. Okay. <laughs> no. <laughs> You were just uh, having crap luck with a, the time bomb, huh? would it, Hold on, would it be a Canadian and he does a jutsu by any chance? Ha-ha! Name recognition! <laughs> <laughs> uh, I can give you props. I wouldn't have the patience to even go through one minute of that game. <laughs> Same. He, he did it, and he mastered the game's shittiness. <laughs> <laughs> So, uh, C CJ, did you learn how to do the duck walk? It's pretty cool, huh? Yeah, it is. Super uh, cool. <laughs> so, they, But so, Zelda doesn't duck walk because she's a lady. <laughs> so, CJ, are you going to do... Um, are you going to do uh, BS Legend of Zelda Link to the Past? Oh. Someone, someone actually compiled a, a, compiled a full ROM of that. Oh, oh you mean... Did? Oh, you mean... Uh, oh, the the... Oh, the, the broadcast one... version of Link to the Past, not the uh, not Yeah, the, the broadcast. Yeah. I'll do it. I like it. I really like uh, Link to the Past, so... Thank you! I want to I do, like, a randomizer of it someday. Man, look. Oh, let, also, let me... the, the other let thing... Me... Since, you, since you brought up BS Zelda, um, another thing is the sequel to Link to the Past is uh, also... Um, is also has a full ROM as well that they were able to save. So, uh, if you want to play Ancient Star Tablets, you can. Oh yeah, I was I was planning on doing that after I do a, an actual normal run of Zelda: A Link to the Past. Honestly, that randomizer run was so good. It really doing randomizers just it it makes you think more about the game and its design and how to tackle problems in such a different way. And it's even better when you know like all of the little glitches, like the uh, damage boost glitching with, with saving and quitting. So it's it's, it's, it's pretty nice. One thing I would never stage. do though, is I would never do a randomizer where I have to find a sword. I, I hate that. I've done six of them and I have never gotten past oh, like man. at least one dungeon. That, that's the that's the interesting thing of what you're able to do without the sword, so. Oh yeah, I mean, I'm not going to deny that. That is, that is literally like the favorite thing is like trying to take out certain bosses without, you know, certain things. 
but like there's like there's a lot of things you actually have to have in uh alia come on i was trying to fly here alia Shut hey up, do you read me hello guys can you read me no make um, a man make a man <laughs> <laughs> No, but like a lot X, of people. X, there's don't... danger here. Yeah. No. Thanks, alien. No. <laughs> really? <laughs> All right, there Watch we go. Out. Those are bottomless pits. Can you hear me? You don't know where they lead. I didn't know. Can you hear me, Axel? Shut up! Shut the fuck up! Hey. Okay. Axel is a wonderful human. He's not Did a human. Did someone He's say? <laughs> Triple, Triple Axel time? <laughs> well, this is the thing, is I actually really like Axel's character. They just put him, his introduction, unfortunately, was in a really shitty game. His introduction was I'm also like... Quite... His voice actor wasn't exactly that good for Guys. such a shitty game. I mean, like, I okay, no, okay, shit okay, on get... people's shitty voice acting because I have shitty voice acting. No, 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 okay, let me, let me, let me specify. Axel's voice actor in X7 is a, is a, one of the few god tier voice actors. She just she just voices one thing. She's she's kind of like uh, the Go Goku's voice actress who just uses her kid Goku voice for everything. You know, mm. so it's not her fault. But like, so uh, it's a uh, it's a problem of miscast, really. Yeah, I do like his um his uh his X eight thing. I think it's Quinn Flynn. Yeah. yeah, it's Oh, cool. so, uh... So, so it's right a base. Yeah. It's right <laughs> from, uh, from Metal Gear. Yeah. yeah. Kurno, we've managed to not drown. <laughs> well, see, here's the thing. I wasn't telling Axel to shut up. I was telling Alia to shut up. You wanna know how I got my name? <laughs> I fucking oh, love Oh, shit. I was... Yeah, you know, I always thought the hate on Raiden was just kind of overblown. It's just because, like, it's because of the marketing. That's the thing, is a lot of people feel like they were tricked by the marketing. Which mm. was the whole point. It was the what whole point of it, is to trick everybody to think you're going to play nice a stage. Yeah, I got, I got, you I got, you got sure you can to death. That, that would have uh, spoiled the game, too, to be honest with you. Yeah, if they showed the right. I want to, I want to point out, I want to point out that people tend to not like the character they tend not they tend not to like um characters voiced by quentin flynn okay because they didn't like axel they didn't like raiden and they didn't like silver the hedgehog well i mean to be fair though uh he didn't voice silver the hedgehog until later so wait who Thing was his is, voice actor in um, 06 it's not the voice actor's fault it's the direction, the line yeah. leads. Like, yeah. I mean, there's and only so much you can do with let's, some of those lines. Let's Although, write in from Revengeance got better. Yeah, the, the thing is... Write in from before got better. Yeah, I was going to say, the uh, the hate for writing kind of died down uh, after Metal Gear Solid 4, so... Yeah. He was great for... Oh, yeah. I, mean, I actually, like, out of all the character motivations that was going on in that game, his was the most interesting. Yeah. I didn't I didn't even mind him in two, he wasn't that bad. He was just a little grimy, I guess. Hmm. I mean it's Definitely. understandable because he spent most of his time in VR training instead of pad roll. No! No! Damn it! Yeah. <laughs> and and he was only used as a pawn to to simulate uh, another Shadow Moses to see if they could create mm. soldiers that could do the exact same thing that Snake did. Damn, and you just get wrecked sure or you not. Again. I got wrecked again. Uh, it's that sure you can. It basically is un like if you get hit by it, you can't recover. I think the issue here though is that people wanted to play as the main character that they were used to, and Raiden wasn't it. Uh, that that's basically the same response people had for Nero from Devil May Cry Four. I don't exactly hate Metal Gear Solid 2. I'll never play it. But I don't particularly hate most of it. Except for, like, the last part of it. With the explanation with the Patriots and all. Because it's one of those, oh, you can't fight your own fate kind of bullshit. And I just really, really hate those kind of speeches. Mm. I'm like... 
Yeah. Okay. Let me fight Solidus. We can talk about fate related bullshit later. Nah, he's gotta choke you out first. It's all about the floor plane. You can't just <laughs> dump your entire evil speech on somebody. You gotta you gotta you gotta play with it. You gotta build it up. Yeah. You gotta, you gotta touch it a little with your own. Exactly. You gotta be in it. Hey, that's how I see it. You'll say. So if anyone's wondering, they're a lot of fun. Cutting out. I said if anyone was wondering, Dungeon Defenders 2. Pretty fun. Actually worth worth picking up. Even I'm not sure about spending money on it, but it's worth picking up. Uh, I don't even know what that is. It's a it is a tower defense game made by uh, uh not a big tower defense guy. Same. It, you know, you can't you can do things as as the characters and like that. What what set it apart from this original is that you could play as four different characters at once and use their abilities as you, as needed. Uh, you know what? Let's switch to the monk. Uh, Are you playing that right now? Yeah, it's something I'm doing. I'm also watching the stream. I didn't say any. I didn't say anything about the. I'm not mad if you're not watching the stream. I'm just. I was just so, wondering what you were playing. Yeah, I'm. I'm. I'm not going to say anything about you getting sure you can buy uh, Spiral Pegasus twice. Because, um, because because that happens. That happens every time someone fights Spiral Pegasus. It's it's unavoidable. Don't you mean the Skyver? <laughs> Skyver. I hated that name. <laughs> That's like one of the only names that, that I just did not like. I didn't like the Skyver. Like I, I understood. Was, I thought it was cool. Also, just a thing to note: that guy was from the Repla Force. Yeah, yes. he's one of the last few members of the Repla Force. And I think related to Storm Owl and Eagle. No. I'm not. No, I don't know if he's related oh. to them. Eagle oh, was well, Eagle Matt. was never part of the Repla. Well, he was, he was a Maverick. Yeah. Maverick Hunter, yeah. yeah. Mega Man X6 was the well, at last... at least references their attack. At least references one of their attacks. Um, X6 was the last, um, game that had members of the Repla Force and members of the Maverick Hunters. Uh, I think... Mage. Mate. And this is where everyone and now realizing Zero's not being affected by the virus. Uh, is that a red flag? Crimson. And there's Light's Life Shaver. I've been wondering where he was. Saver. Yeah, he has. To, well, he's got to rescue Zero towards the end. I'll sit late. He's got to save somebody's life. That right. is, if he man is, if he manages to uh, destroy the colony with the shovel. Shuttle. I cannot speak English today. No worry, I can never speak English. It's such a foreign language. Can you speak English? That impossible. <laughs> no, it's me fail English. That's impossible. I know. I know. I modified it for the situation. Uh, let's see. Um, <laughs> he was trying to use wordplay. I know. <laughs> okay, good. That this is this setup is actually working, so I can play this solo. So what's your next stage, mate? Um, and will you beat this game tonight? Uh, maybe. Yeah, I've got like just under an hour left, so usually the Sigma stages take me a couple hours because of some of the bosses. Uh, and of course, the boss watch rush. 
But I think what I'm going to do then is I'm going to take on Matrax or whatever his name is in this game, and I'm going to take the Falcon Armor with Burn me. Burn Dino Rex. Is it Burn Dino Rex? It is Burn Dino Rex. That sounds stupid. It's kind of a cool name. <laughs> I love how somebody's like, that's stupid, and I'm like, yeah, it's kind of cool. I mean, the design isn't bad, but the name... I think I just prefer the original PS1 name. I love these little, like, dragon or... I, like I said, Bolt Kraken can stay Bolt Kraken. Grid Adler is eh. This is probably the closest thing to an, an actual proper thing, but Vault Kraken is so. I agree. Vault Kraken can stay. Vault Kraken, you can stay. But that launch octopus guy has gotta go. Don't you mean Octopardo? Yeah. <laughs> Octopardo. It took me a, it took me a while to figure out that he actually meant launch octopus. <laughs> yeah, no. It took us until a let's play to figure that out. Yeah, our let's play in this game, we were like, wait. Oh yeah, free life, because I'm probably gonna die. Ah, oh, yeah, I just barely missed it. That's all right. I got the heart. Um, another lightning strike aura here. All right. I'm not gonna take chances with the stage because the stage is son of a bitch. The stage is son of a bitch. Is a son of a bitch. <laughs> son of a bitch! Son, son of a bitch. bitch! Oh no! Son of a bitch! I'm gonna do it again! And yes, this is a JoJo reference. Uh, damn right. Yeah, 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 so yeah, somebody yeah, made me yeah, realize yeah. something yesterday that apparently, um,. Uh, that, uh, part, uh, part three, part four, and part five have similarities with Persona 3, 4, and 5. And that's why people say, uh, the Persona 6 will have a female lead. <laughs> and why it'll take place in prison. <laughs> or something, wait, yeah. Wait, 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 what are we talking about? <laughs> Comparing JoJo's to Persona. Oh. A bitch, but I'm all plus the stand plus stands are pretty uh, are a pretty similar concept to the personas so oh. a, a, ju a juvenile detention center would be an interesting thing where all mm. the protagonists are actually bad people mm. yeah. I kind of like that aspect story <laughs> some people actually have like an interesting idea of what they wanted persona 6 to be like uh like something about like people getting sick and it has some some connections with uh with like the world you you'd have to travel to. Mm -hmm. Oh hey, a ride armor. I'm gonna skip the ride armor because the ride armor section sucks. You fool! Why would you skip the ride armor? Because the ride armor section sucks. But it's an X staple. Don't you need that for the Gaia armor? The Gaia. 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 Not, not Gaia. <laughs> I mean, it is pretty fabulous. I won't lie. It's gray. What's fabulous about gray? <laughs> it's just fabulous. Okay, correct me. I mean, I mean, maybe, uh, maybe, um, Sherry from, uh, from, um, uh, Zatch Bella Bridge would say it's fabulous. Oh, Purple I think it's fabulous. Three. I've been calling it I've been calling it the Gaia armor for years. I apologize. <laughs> nah, it's fine. You know how I know it's Gaia? Because of Captain Planet. Yeah, Captain Planet. Thanks over with I hate Gaia's that Gaia's show. Whoopi Goldberg. Oh, it, was Whoopi. it was Whoopi. It was Whoopi. So, um 
So, uh, my buddy, speaking of Captain Planet, my buddy, uh, uh, Vegeta 396 told me that he had his first acting class, and then the next one he's gonna have to read from official Captain Planet scripts. Nice. He's gonna have to be, uh, <laughs> he's gonna have to be, he's gonna have to do practice voices for Mati and a whole bunch of other people, because apparently he's working with the person who was, like, a producer on those shows. Wow. Huh. It sounds, I'm not even sure... If I could call that an interesting... I'm not... I don't know what to say about that. I do. The power, power is yours! Yeah. I hated Captain that had, Jeff Goldblum was in that too, Yeah, he? he was, um... He was, he was uh, a rat guy. Vermin. Yeah, he was Vermin. Yeah. He was a rat guy. And really? he... That was, like, the only role that Jeff Goldblum has ever done where he wasn't Jeff Goldblum. <laughs> 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 Oh, wait, that's, that's because probably the audio yeah, editor is like, man, I need to cut a lot of the space ah, out of these shit. That was that was dumb. I screwed that no, up. No, but like like people don't understand that like um Thor Ragnarok, that wasn't him playing the the, the, the what was it the Grandmaster? That was the Grandmaster playing J J um Jeff Goldblum. Okay, <laughs> now we have yeah. to do uh, all that shit again. Yeah, because I I uh, fucked up. I forgot where the armor piece was for a second. I'm like, wait a minute, isn't it over here? And I'm like, nope. If I'm gonna be honest, though, I kind of wish Jeff Goldblum was the main villain because the actual main villain wasn't all that interesting. What? Thor three? Yeah, I didn't. I didn't. Thor three was great. I just didn't like the. Well, that's the thing is, her her reason for being bad is like really relatable. Like, I understand her motivations clearly, and it's not that she was in the right or anything, but at least she, because her father locked her away. And then, not only just locked her away, but, like, hid her existence completely. Rewriting history. Just mm. made her an unperson. Yeah, right? And you're like, I see the justification of you doing this, but holy shit, are you crazy, too, right? Like, I mean... It's just that. It's just how I see it. I'm like, you know what? If you thought she was bland, then that's that's your opinion. But there was a lot more to her that I guess wasn't outwardly explained to the audience. Uh, like Jeff Goldblum, because Jeff Goldblum just explains himself. Yeah, Jeff, he was fun in that movie. I'm just, I'm just saying. He was absolutely really welcome music I've ever seen. He was absolutely pointless in the second Jurassic World. They just got him for a cameo, really. Yeah, that was... He doesn't even say any of his iconic lines or anything. It's just like, if you're going to bring him back, like, have him be like, a uh, this, like, or maybe they're saving him for the third movie, I don't know. Um, and that's why he was only in that courtroom. Well, they are saying to bring back Dr. Grand. That'd be good. There it is. That's where the armor is. Yay. There it is, right over there. And uh, all that fire. Fire? Fire! <laughs> fire. So, Kirby, fire. to answer your question, because I've died a couple times at parts that are really lengthy, uh, probably not tonight. <laughs> oh, okay. Because um, I, I have a feeling that I'm probably not going to beat this <laughs> tonight, because I know those Sigma stages are going to kick my ass. Probably. Nope. Plus there's the boss, boss rush. Those are always fun. Insert Dark Souls meme here? No. No. <laughs> I'm not playing on hard mode. <laughs> <clears throat> you played on... You played it with uh, Rookie Hunter mode on. <laughs> wow. Are you trying to like rub in the Mega Man 11 shit? On him again. Like he, like he tried to, he tried to call him <laughs> out on the fact that I beat X7 on Rookie Hunter mode, but he didn't understand it. I, I it's X7. X7. That one you get a pass with. No, no, no. But you have to understand that I, I've owned <laughs> X7 way before I got the X collection, and I tried oh, yeah, to beat same. it normally. So, oh, like, I owned it too. <laughs> so <laughs> I'm lucky. I did on that. I rented it when I was playing it for the first time. I had to get Mark actually got had to get me a copy of X7 because I couldn't find it anywhere. 
I need to speaking of speaking of stuff, I need to go to start going to GameStop again down here and see if they still have those uh discounted uh PlayStation 2 games. Do a little bargain hunting. Kind of doubt it. I never seen any GameStop with I uh, was I was shocked when we went to uh when we went when we were in Connecticut and we went to a GameStop and they had PS2 games. I'm like, "Wait a minute. This was like and this was like 5 6 years ago." I was like, "Wait a minute." They have PS2 used PS2 games, yeah. Because EB Games didn't devil? even have those. Like they had gotten rid of those like really early. Uh, at some point, uh, GameStop uh, wanted to try try uh, selling retro games. So no, no, this was way before that. Oh, this was one of the years we went to Kineticon, dude. Okay, I, so, I forgot when that. So had, like, they, they had a bunch of like uh, they had a bunch of uh, um. PS2 games loose in uh, in paper cases. I got Deus Ex and a couple other games actually that way. Ah, nice, nice. I mean, like going to GameStop and picking up PS2 games is how I completed the Dark Hat GU collection. How I found Dark Cloud and uh, Let Me Snick in and the series of unfortunate events, which unfortunately broke for me. Is that actually a good game? It was actually a really interesting puzzle stuff game. I like how uh, dinos let a like, uh, whenever you hit him with his weakness. Yeah, I hate this guy. Uh, anyway, I was gonna say, I was gonna say, Kirby, I'm not gonna bitch at. I'm sorry for bitching at you about rookie hunter mode, but considering the fact I had to beat X7 on a stream normal mode, and people were telling me to stop when I didn't, I think I'm crazy. No, oh, we know you're crazy. Know. Well, like, you this, this is the thing. It's like you're determined. Just because you're determined about something doesn't mean you're crazy. I guess oh. if you are wanting to, you're so determined to jump off a bridge, that means you're kind of crazy, I guess. But I don't know. I don't like putting people down. You saw a challenge, you wanted to take it, and you accepted it. That's not crazy. That's you beating it. You doing it. Yeah, because oh, thank God, A, possible. I was doing a written review for it, and B, I had a bone to pick with that game. And if you I put it on working hunter mode, that would have defeated the purpose. Oni, uh, are you still doing the video version of that, or? Oh yeah, yeah, I still got the script and everything. I just need to modify it and shit. Hmm. I just need some time before I go back into it. <laughs> that okay. sounded. Uh, you need a Oni's need a review moment. of Mega Man X7 coming out 2020. Me, calm down. This is hey, not wrong. That, that actually may mean that Zero will cover Mega Man, Elect uh, Mega Man 11 first. Ooh. Ooh. Ah. Oh, there. How long? How long is it going to take, Zero? The game is starting to, it's starting to wane on that shelf. It's starting to collect some dust. The review will come out when you least expect it. <laughs> on Valentine's Day? No, I actually have something else planned for Valentine's Day. I actually hey, got a review. Do you want me to edit that? <laughs> For old time's I mean, sakes. if you want, no, no, you don't have to. I, I got this one. Um, you know, I don't know why I'm trying. To, I don't know why I'm trying to bid up this the Huntress. I, don't I mean, use her. like I was, th I was thinking to myself the other day, and like I've written a lot of scripts. I don't know if I'll be able to get all these videos done in a regular amount of time. Maybe I should hire someone to start editing for me. <laughs> but I'm like, with reviews, it's one of those things where I'm like, I really want control over stuff. Though to be fair. You did a if you, smashing good job on the yeah. uh, the one review. So, but even then, even if I was like your reviewer, uh, your review editor, I wouldn't be like, "Well, this is my creative vision." You all are saying means nothing at this point. Like, you could help out and slash, or like you would hire them with the sole purpose of doing your vision, not theirs. Yes. Say. Oh look, we're going to deal with Dynamo again. And Zero's gonna do it again. <laughs> Zero's like, why do I have to do this? You were complaining about being bored. Oh, okay. <laughs> he's gotta, he's gotta defend the rocket. If if he wants to fly it, don't touch my rocket. <laughs> uh, Zero, that didn't sound Zero, right. Zero, do you really want to pilot the rocket? <laughs> yes. Then you're going to defend the rocket. Yeah. If there's no rocket for you to take, Zero. But, but guys, the only reason Zero launches the rocket is because he's the only pilot. What? 
<laughs> yeah, one place he had for a pilot. Yeah, that was that's part of the story that uh, doesn't get explained very well. Okay, all right. I mean, all right. I mean, so, it makes zero. No. Why he's the only pilot. Was he part of the Rebel Force? I can't remember if Zero trained in the Rebel Force. Oh, I'm Are sure he did. His girlfriend was in the Rebel Force, so he had to have done something with them. Yeah, I just don't know because, like, then maybe that's where he got his flight training. There's also the fact that you know, you kind of killed any Maverick hunters that had like capabilities yeah well, so did X, pretty but... much any sort yeah. of maverick that could fly the shuttle oh never probably... mind they were probably infected nuts. by the sigma virus yeah yeah mm -hmm. yeah but where did zero find the time to become a pilot that's always the thing i guess maybe he was <laughs> he's maybe... a robot zero how long <laughs> how long do you think it's gonna take him to learn how to fly something <laughs> this is the this is the problem with him being the one flying it's like, why specifically? Because any of those Repoloids could fly it. Yes, we need to make an excuse for <laughs> X to fight Zero. Yeah. All right. But the translation is shoddy. Is all I'm saying. Yeah, right. we wouldn't, we wouldn't, we wouldn't get another, another Maverick Hunter until like the spinoff game. As a Maverick. Are you, talk are you talking about the RPG or? Yeah, the RPG. The last, the last, the last three um, Maverick Hunters that you actually fight. Is uh, Shadow, Death Dragoon, and Colonel Redup. And that one's not even canon. I like to think that's canon. Okay, the heart you get with the guy. Well, armor. I mean, that's the thing is, if they make an X11, it will be canon. Yeah. X11. Don't you mean X9? Oh, X9. Right. X10. Whoa! Somebody's jumping the gun. Someone. I always forget that they're not. Uh, they're not on par with one another. You must uh I I was assuming you uh traveled to the future and played X10. Yes. <laughs> it's the it's that's command mission. We all thought it was its own thing, but command <laughs> mission. That I hope is canon, because there's some really cool costumes in that. Some really cool costumes, yeah, the some really cool character. Marino's Bay. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm, I'm Spike not, I, I, Rose Red. It doesn't say their name, so I gotta add my own flair. Yeah. Otherwise Axel known as the Axel Red. They, the they Red. Did. did they ever say them in X5? I no, don't think didn't. they did. They didn't. They, they kind of cheaped out on X5 in, a, in quite a few places, actually. Yeah. Um, and X6. I'm getting oh, tired, definitely so cheaped out I think I'm gonna go to bed. Alright. All right. Right. So the, the, the funny thing about it is X5... X6 is fully voice acted, but X5 is not. So it's almost like they were really tr like X5 was one they were really trying to get out the door. Um, zero. You're gonna find this funny. Remember that um, that review you did? You had to use footage for my channel. Use footage for my channel. Yeah. Did you know that I've, I've never done a, a, a playthrough of Sonic uh, Sonic uh, Mania? I don't think it was you. I put my name on it. Did I put your name on it? You put my. You, you took. You took footage from that. Um, from that uh, video I made showing someone where all the three big rings is in um, Green Hill Zone. Yeah. <sighs> Sonic Mania is a great game, though. Was that somebody else's gameplay? Did I screw up? No, that was no, that was me. No, I'm just saying I've never done. I've never for my channel done a complete playthrough of Sonic Mania. Get on it! Yeah, you should. That game is it's awesome. A, it's such a good game, though. Uh, I'm like all Sonic games. I find them really hard. Well, I mean, I... you, you, aren't you like? Uh, I, I would think Mega Man's harder than Sonic. To be honest. Mm. Well, see, that's the thing. You get a shoot button, with Mega Man. You can shoot stuff with Mega the, Man. The, the problem really is, the problem is, uh, like for example, the first Sonic is uh, more of a platformer than like a speed game. Whereas yeah. the later games are more of like speed games, but um, the problem is is that uh, because of that, there's lots of like easy deaths and stuff like that. My problem is is like, I, there's always sections I get to where I where I run out of lives and then I can't continue. But I know like the closest I ever got was, uh, um, uh, was it uh, Sonic 3? Because you can actually save your game in that one. Yeah. 
I mean, I never beat the first two Sonic, Sonic games either, uh, but Sonic 3 I did beat. And we got the boots. I guess uh, I guess it's probably I I probably say that because uh, I'm more of a Sonic guy than a Mega Man guy, so I guess I'll have I, a little. I I want to beat a Sonic game one of these days, but like it's uh... actually <laughs> the closest I ever got to beating a Sonic game was Sonic Generations, and I couldn't beat the last boss. But that last boss, apparently, from what I've heard from a lot of other people, is just a pain in the ass. So it was you you uh, I I was able to. Beat it by uh, some miracle, but thing is, you gotta make sure to keep keep up with uh, having your rings and everything. I literally I, got to the end of the game and this boss, and I'm like, I can't do this. I can't beat this thing. I, this is impossible. I, I feel, I feel, I feel, I feel terrible because you guys are saying that, and I beat that boss in the first try. That happens. Yeah, <laughs> it happens way I more mean, than I wish it would. <laughs> Everybody was like, oh, you know that re that first your first light encounter. It's gonna be hard because you're not gonna understand it. And then you, I fought the water one, and he just sort of took Died. it. <laughs> <laughs> just took it. Uh, I will say though, uh, if you ever like try to play like one of the Sonic Adventure games, they're uh, easier to beat. Well, I am playing Adventure Two with my buddy Billy, so. Ah, nice. We'll be yeah, that, that one. Except he's doing all the knuckle stages, because fuck the knuckle stages. He's like, yeah, I'll do all the knuckle stages, but you have to do the trash tail well, stages. His name I'm is like, Knuckles. I'm like, I'll do the I... tail stages. Just fine. Yeah. Yeah, the tail stages aren't that bad, to be honest. It's just too much shooting. But. Uh, one of the levels. Two of the levels' tail stages really annoyed me. <laughs> mm. So. Let me guess. Prison Isle and. Haven't gotten. Uh, have I gotten. Wait, where's Prison Is that the start of the game? Prison Isle is the, um... Is the... Second tail stage. The one where you have... Is that the one where you have to find the, uh... You have to race against the, uh... Uh... You have to catch up to the... The limo? Yeah. The limousine? Yes, that one's... That one was Yeah, that one sucks, and then there's the... 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 The pyramid one. That one Yeah, that sucks. one's... That one. That yeah. one. That level sucks both both for Eggman and Tails. Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah pretty I much like Sonic that, yeah. and Shadow are the uh, best gameplay styles. <laughs> but like, I know that's kind of no shit. Knuck Knuckles and Rouge's stuff it doesn't get terrible until Meteor Herd and uh, what's what was the name of Rouge's level? Eh. I can't remember it. It's literally their last level. Their last level. That's when it's just like, okay, we're done here. What was it? Uh, the <laughs> stage, the like, Billy was okay with doing the uh, the knuckle stages until they got to the one where the water fills up, and then he's like, this is this is Garbo. <laughs> oh, yeah, no, that that's... Yeah, that um, fucking painful. Quadic Mind. Because I... Because yeah. th that is one... That's another song. Great song from the game. I love that song. Uh, I think the, the problem with the treasure hunting stages is that, is that they're really boring. Oh, the and the and the one after it where you have to go between the rooms with different colors. Oh my god. Oh uh, yeah, the, the everything that has to do with the desert, uh, except for Sonic Sonic Stage, is just kind of why yeah. am I here? Even yeah. Sonic Stage was a little bit of. Uh. I like Sonic Stage. Normally, I li normally I like desert levels, but. <laughs> I I actually like the Sonic Stage in the desert, and I, and uh, I also really. I mean, it's the it's boss not thing. it's not like. The worst thing ever, but it's not amazing. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm have to, I have to apologize to everyone, but I'm going to have to get the new Sonic Racing game. I was going to pass it. Oh, uh, until, Sonic Team ahead. Racing. Yeah, I was going to pass it until they, until they announced that not only Jun Snow was coming back to work on the music, they also, get, they're also doing collabs with T Lopes. Mm. Okay, see, this is the thing, I would, it sounds and it looks really good, but these next couple of months are just very, very bad on my wallet. Oh, I, I added, I, 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 I put, put there. In January, there's two games, then in March, there's three games for me because DOA 6 fucking comes out. I am so uh, stoked about oh, that. Oh, by, by I, the way, uh, I also put more money down on RE2 today, but uh, nice. on top of uh, cl picking up the collector's edition of Toki, and also... Nice. Um, SNK Heroines was marked down, so I picked that up. Nice. I'm, I Ooh. need, I need to get some money in my pocket for February 9th, because I need yeah. to get on that game real what fast. What game is that? I, I 
got a God Eater three. Oh shit. Oh. Yeah, God I, got, Eater I still got a beat. And there's that Samurai PlayStation Four exclusive that's coming out too. Seko Ken, uh, whatever it's called. Oh my God, oh, it's I need to Yeah. Oh, I yeah, didn't know that was coming out. Nice. Yeah. Hold on. It's uh, also that, coming out in March. That game looks good. <laughs> you know, there's also uh, Travis Strikes Again. I, I want to try that one out. Oh my god. Yeah, oh my yeah, god. That, that comes out at the end of the month, doesn't it? I, I think it's this week. I'm not sure, though. Is it this week? It or is. Next? Oh, it okay. Is. It is. I have the first two No More Heroes, but I haven't played through them, so I kind of want to play through them before I play that one, but... Ace Combat yeah. 7 is coming out next Please. time, February Oh, two. Zero. Zero, that should be a stream idea. No More Heroes 1. Actually, oh, yeah, that'd be fun. No More I Heroes actually 1. Got, no I actually got the um, <laughs> HD remastered of uh, Onimusha Warlords. Mm, nice. Yeah, I wanted yeah, to that, get that. That, came, that just, that came, just out. came out. Yeah, just, yeah. That just came out today. 20 bucks. That's not bad. Yeah. Well, it is, it is just an HD part. Yeah, but hey, again, twenty dollars can't beat that. Old game though. <laughs> I forgot that I forgot that ge they remade that game, and I, 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 I'm not sure if I'm gonna pick that up or not. Toad Jam and Earl back in the groove. Uh, eh. That's a pass for me. I'm just not a fan of Toad Jam and Earl. Yeah, I'm not. I found Toad Jam and Earl kind of boring, to be honest. Back in the poor. But uh, February game release, uh, Ace Combat 7, Crackdown 3, Far Cry New Dawn, to make it a new Far Cry game. And isn't that Obsidian game coming out this year, too? Uh, what was it? Is it Obsidian game? Um, I can't remember. It's something. It's not like, oh, crap. What is that game called? Outer Worlds? Outer Worlds? Yeah, something. Something like that. It's by Obsidian. It's the guys that made. Um, it's the Outer Worlds. It's it's the Outer Worlds. Oh, the there you are. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, let me look that up real quick. Oh uh, no, there's no. Kevin, where day. were you? Oh, we need you. We need you to do your rich impression. For what? Oh, we were we were referencing the uh, the Rogue One review by Red oh. Letter Media. I thought you were bringing up how we kept seeing solo posters at Anime North. <laughs> Solo! Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm gonna go! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> that I'm was amazing. Not, I'm still not sure if I'm going to pick up Anthem. So, just a quick thing for the stage. Yes, the stage does... The gimmick of the stage is to slow your frame rate down. <laughs> that's, that's, that's not how you say X6. What does the oh. Grouse Garbage say? Oh. oh! Sorry, not slow your frame rate, but slow the game down. I hate Grouse Garbage Stage. That is like, out of all the X stages in the in the series, that stage has to be the worst, just due to RNG. Good old RNG, Jesus. Right. So, uh, tomorrow I'm seeing uh, Dragon Ball. Oh, Broly? Oh yeah, I'm seeing that on Friday with Cory. I'm seeing that tomorrow. Is Cory in the house? <laughs> oh, he it's never hears that anime. joke. He never hears that <laughs> joke. I, I kept saying that, and then everyone got annoyed with me for saying that. Yeah, I kept saying it too, and everybody got annoyed. Oh, um, nah. And when Nightman kills the memes, you know they're super dead. Nightman, Lord of Memes. Yeah, I'm the meme lord Night of this stream. Them memes, I hear. Yeah. Hey man, I've been Get out! That. I've been yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, are you, did you finish Kam Katamari Damachi? I have not yet. I was I was looking for those streams to pop back up because I wanted to watch that. So. I mean, uh, I'll I'll give you I'll give you the uh, <clears throat> I'll, I'll I'll post the link to uh, the stream if I ever go back go back to it. I just uh, you know kind of was busy with other shit. Ah. <laughs> uh... God, I hate when they put the spikes right there. Yeah. Next Friday, next Friday, I'm gonna be streaming, and, and I want I want like some of you guys to come. What time? Oh, uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna make it a later stream, so probably the same time you usually stream. Ah, uh, okay. All right. So, so, and I and I say this is because that's when the new Monster Hunter event comes out. Ah, okay. Well, I'll be on, I'll be down to play that. Yeah. I'll, I'll be down to watch, I guess. I, uh, 
I really need to get back to that game. I kind of what's the what's the new event? It is called. It's basically the New Year's event. I forgot the official name of it, but they're gonna have a whole bunch of new uh, layered armors. They're gonna be like, there's like there's a new cat suit with a new Pelico suit with a disco ball. Wow, fro. So. so does anybody miss uh, uh, Cyber Peacock stage? That's what I do what this part of the stage is. I do. CJ <laughs> called me out. <laughs> CJ called me out on my video. I do. Uh, Sorry, yeah. Peacock. <laughs> I mean, more it was like... so good. I don't know, man. <laughs> Cyber Peacock. More like. More like. Uh, more like Cyber Urine Penis. What? <laughs> okay. So, that was um. Dumb. Peacock. People, people won't be. People won't see this, but I'm gonna post it. Uh, people watching the stream and watching the vods won't see this, but I'm gonna post this in the dang May Mays chat. Uh, some of the some of the new cosmetics from the, the next event. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's. Oh, that heart is such a pain in the ass to get. Oh, I got it. Oh yeah, the balls are back from X4. My the favorite part. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> we damn haven't it. heard that joke before. Never <laughs> in my life. <laughs> Same here. Okay, wow. this is officially the worst yeah. part of this stage. Getting the fucking wanna... armor part. I want to oh, point out yeah. that they made those giant those giant dragonflies are from um uh what is his name from X2? The bug. It was, a, it was a morph moth stage. Wait, can't you just charge an F laser? Mm, he can, but it won't do what it needs to be done. Trap in, folks. We're gonna be here for a while. <clears throat> Fuck. This fucking sucks. I hate this. Ah, damn it. Um, with the leg, this does not help. Ah. ah, damn it. Ah! Ah, alright, suicide. <laughs> Okay, attempt number two. This one really, really sucks to get. This is like the yeah, worst armor part to get in the entire game. I don't blame you. I had to get it myself. <laughs> mm -hmm. Did you remember how many times it took in our Let's Play for this? Oh, it's fine. Oh, that? Guy oh, over. gosh. I, and I was the one that ended up doing it. I've if done I it. I can do this. I know, I, yeah, I'm not saying that you can't do it. It's just like, I remember we we had gotten to a point where you're like, you fucking try it. So that must have been a while. <laughs> Several hours later. Yeah, this might be... One eternity later. This is, why, this is why I won't be able to finish the game in this stream, because... Uh, <laughs> bullshit like this. Damn it. Mm. Ah. Somebody set up a rage counter. No. My name's not Oni Rokaku. Oh, fuck you too! <laughs> oh, well, okay, okay, fine. Set up a mildly annoyed counter. Damn it! Did you say your name was Oni Bukake? What? Honey, eat this pillow! <laughs> Oh, 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 I'm sorry, says the woman, says the woman that was trying to get your magic bug for the last yesterday. <laughs> I'm sorry. For the last yesterday? What? Uh, yeah, what? I spent like two, uh, I spent yesterday and today trying to find a hair across. And getting pissed off on No, 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 it. I, I have to, I have to ask, like, last yesterday. I'm tired, it's piss the off. Yes, it's the yesterday before yesterday. You just yesterday. woke up from a nap. <laughs> And I get tired when I wake up. I'm cranky. 
Drink your coffee. You're not wrong. Damn it! If I drink coffee, I'm gonna be up half the night. Well, you don't become the great cornholio? Oh no, no. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to paint drying. <laughs> <laughs> so, about Onimusha Warlords! Ah! Come on. Oh. Mm -hmm. oh. It's that one fucking turn that's the worst. You have to be quick, and it's... Ah! Fuck! I always turn too soon. Uh, CJ, who did your title thing, by the way, for uh, your video? Oh, the title card? No, not the title card art, but like... You know, your Aunt Dude of the video intro thing. You know what I mean? Oh, oh what the, the dun dun thing and I and the, my name popped down? You yeah, mean was that? That, just me? that was, that... I, I just made it, yeah. Was that an animation? I can't remember. Uh, all I did was slide the text down and I had this little lens flare video effect happen. Okay. Because I might put one of those types of things in my top ten. I'm just like, ah, zero, you do it. <laughs> <laughs> I, can, I, I don't know, I don't, I don't know, I don't make it. Jake? I mean, I can make it for you if you want. I, but I, I should actually be editing my shit. <laughs> well, I still There's got a lot of things I need to edit. I <gasps> got video game to record, anyways. God hey damn there, it. Alright. Want a soda? No, want I got a soda? water. Damn it. Okay, you, should, you don't want a soda. You can get I'm, you a I'm soda. Good. I'm good. Right. Quiet, Stewie. <laughs> no, no, this is a test. You know. Water is good for you. Please drink more water than soda. Mm. Where's Hydra Bite when you need him? Yeah. Yeah, Hydrate Bite. Where the fuck have you been, buddy? The good news is if you hit continue on this part, you go back to the last <laughs> checkpoint you were at. So I could literally do this all night if I have to. Please don't. I mean, I'd like to not. Ooh, Pure Fortune, then where are you, man? Then I would have to, um, force you to eat a pillow. What the, what the fuck does that even mean? What? Yeah, what's that guy doing anything? It's, it's, to, it's to quiet the screams. But you can so, do that with a lot of things. My name's not a long guy, you mean, man. Quiet, man. Yeah. Yeah. You mean like scream in a pillow, you mean? You can probably shove a, a beat down somebody's throat. Fucking God! Fucking you your fucking ass. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no comment. I knew this was going to be a pain in the ass. Well, I mean... Never, I think I'll shut up. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Fuck. See? My sentiment exactly zero. Please provide us with more colorful color commentary. Ooh. It's like watching someone take a golf swing. It's <laughs> lining up for the track. And we're on the corner. Oh, sorry, my voice isn't low enough. We're on the corner of the. <laughs> well, you gotta speak. You gotta speak ASMR style. Like, um, he's setting up for the drive. This is a very difficult shot to be lucky. <laughs> I'm going to take a sip of this water. <laughs> Though, part of me kind of wishes what? that people, no! people uh, commentated golf, but with, like, football announcers. That's yeah, like, I don't oh know, Chuck, God. I don't think that driver is going to get him in there. You know, like, that type of stuff. I really want that out of my golf. And and their table talk is like it, the same it is in football. Be like, I think he's got a good season. And he's gonna, he's going somewhere. He's going somewhere. That up and comer. He may be old, but he's new. <laughs> you get fr you, you get friggin' one. John Madden every time. Every time <laughs> someone gets uh, every time sinks it in the hole. Boom. Oh yeah. Either that or we just have Don Cherry do it because that'd be great. I tell you, these guys they don't know what they're doing. <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't catch me out there. 
doing stuff like that or letting my boys do it that way. Listen, you gotta think with this kid, he's new, he's bright, he's he's happening. <laughs> he's yeah. got a lot going for him, but he's got a big uphill battle to go up against there. So I, I personally, I think that he's uh, he's gonna make it all the way, but I don't want to count my chickens before they hatch. I don't want to commit to anything. Like <laughs> it's pretty much his Look mandate. at my suit. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Ugh. Man, I forgot that he was in a Goosebumps episode. He fuck was? like a kid. Yeah, what? yeah, he was in a Goosebumps episode because it was made up in Canada. So, oh, yeah, yeah, but, I think what? I'm gonna start my stream. But he was, Don, yeah, Don Cherry was. Well, you a should. Goosebumps. Fuck it, impromptu fuck. stream. Let's do it. <laughs> Fucking god. Hey everybody, it's me Oni, and welcome to a stream. If you can tell, it's fuck. my stream because Zero's mad. Fucking god. <laughs> <laughs> See? The rage Man, Chuck, I don't control. think that the angle that is being used at this current operation is getting him the goal. This is so fuck ugh. This is why we're making fun of it, Zero. <laughs> this is such a pain in the ass. <laughs> this is the only part I This is one of the few parts of this game I just like. <laughs> getting this fucking thing. You must be one with the the fire butt thing. Fire butt. <laughs> the fire fire. You must fire be butt. one with the fire butt thing, Zero. Oh my god, I'm doing even worse now. <laughs> ah, it's that one fucking corner. That fucking corner. I can't. Ugh. It's because your health bar is there, and you instinctively think that it's like narrow because of that health bar. That's well, I know always it's, been the problem. I know I it's bigger, it's just, ugh. I believe in you. I'm so close. I'm about to go on that coffee run. Fuck it. Going for a Tim's run there, bud. Oh. No, I'm going for a stick. He's... <laughs> You, you, you want to make a Just, Canadian happy? Hey, I'm going for a Tim's run. Anybody want anything? Yeah. Uh, I'm going oh, for a Tim's run. Pick me up one of those jelly things. <laughs> oh, I want a Boston <laughs> cream, bud. Yeah, is it Boston cream? No, no, it's the other jelly thing, bud. Get me a sour cream donut. A oh, what? those are sound real good, bud. Let's a go. Sou a sour Let's go. cream sour donut. Cream. What's it got? Sour cream in it? No, it's just called yeah. a sour cream donut. Huh. It's actually in the glaze. Yeah, fuck it. I'm going for a Krispy Kreme run. Anybody want anything? <laughs> Back out of the game with Krispy Kreme. <laughs> I'll take a jelly-filled donut. Well, you get it right. Wait, you weren't happy with the one I gave you earlier? What the fuck is a jelly-filled donut? This is an innuendo. Is this an innuendo? I don't know if I like. It actually is. You don't need to know about it. Hey, you don't need to know. Shut up. Excellent. Uh, <laughs> nail. Head. Yeah. <laughs> uh, there is a thing yeah, called heard. a jelly-filled glazed donut. It's like raspberry. Look, chocolate mm -hmm. glaze is the only thing. And if it, and if it was in Canada, it'd be a chocolate blaze donut. Whoa. <laughs> because we're high all the time. I uh, referenced it. <laughs> Fuck me, this fucking ooh, this Sorry, corner. Sorry, I got a fiance. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, I'd oh be my... open to it. Oh she my god! Oh. <laughs> uh, oh my god. This is getting awkward. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> this That's fucking fine. thing. This. Oh. Natural this thing. It's, it's natural. fucking believable. Unfucking believable? Unfucking believable. I'm trying to do Christopher. Yeah. Yeah. This guy. Fucking so unbelievable. No, that's not. It's the game. The game. <laughs> sure, it's, a... it's the game. The game doesn't want you to fi finish it. <laughs> oh my god. You know, I'm just waiting for a fuck you only at any point. <laughs> Alright, if you get it in the next 15 minutes, Zero, then you gotta finish the rest of the game. I can't yeah. tonight, I have to work in the morning. Yeah, well, <laughs> if you get it. Yeah. 
He's playing chicken. Don't take it, man. <laughs> Dude, if you get it, I'll suck your dick. No! no. Fuck oh, you! Oh, oh. <laughs> Oni! Oni, are you being a whore right now? <laughs> I JUST WANTED TO GET THROUGH THIS SHIT! Yeah. This is in, fact, just, in fact, just for that, can somebody please mute him in the Twitch chat? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, is he bannable right now? Yeah. I think, uh, I think Zero might get in trouble wow. for that. that wow, wow, he's not even in the user list right now. Oni. One oh. billion years later. <laughs> Thanks, Chow. Oh, <laughs> See, Chow believes in me. <laughs> Yeah, I am back. But you have to remember that's coming from Chow. It has like inherent sarcasm on it all Kirby. the time. Kirby, what happened? It never <laughs> ends. It is the song that never ends. <laughs> it goes on and on, my friend. Oh come on! I am. Uh... <gasps> no! Oh, oh my no. computer unplugged no. itself. Wait. Wait. Wait for Lord. it. Uh, oh. Oh, oh, I got too uh, excited. Is, still, is 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 he is he still doing the the laser yes! challenge? He's okay. stuck there. He's been there for a while. Oh, I've knitted a sweater since then. Apparently, turning gay. You don't even well. know how to knit. Exactly. Zero, if you get this, I will subscribe to your channel for one month. Wait, you're not subscribed to one me? month. Ooh. Ooh. That's a challenge. I'm subscribed I'm, to I'm, you. Well, neither you. Me, let me up the ante, because I got some money. <laughs> oh, wait, no, are we no talking Twitch? To me. <laughs> uh, are we talking hey, Twitch? Nobody yeah, knows no. who I am, so. No, I'm talking Twitch Prime. Yeah, when they made you, it was sugar spice and everything nice. And then a uh, prof uh, Professor accidentally added an extra ingredient. Snark. <laughs> I remember that time that me and Ch me and I asked Child to join in on a Let's Play, and he, him, and um, I think it was his name, decided to read off a whole bunch of fetishes for no reason in the middle of the recording. Oh I had to scrap. I had I had to scrap that recording. <laughs> I could not put that up. This is this is old YouTube too, so you know that it was bad, but I can't put that up. I saw that CJ. <laughs> You're trying See? to mess me up! <laughs> See, I'll subscribe because I support my friend and not because he needs to make some This fucking <laughs> thing, dude. As I believe. He oh got my me, god! He gave, me a free, he gave me a free sub, I'm gonna give him mine. See, uh, <laughs> it's funny, the way you said that is like... Like, free sub, like, we, I had a two-for-one deal, like, sub Oh uh, yeah, but... Two yeah, for one, two for one? Three, three, three now, it's a sub <laughs> I'm going down, you should. No, I, I, had, I had a free month of... I had a free month of Amazon Prime, and it apparently also gave me a free month of Twitch Prime, so... I was gonna say, I'm going to Subway after this Tim's run, y'all want anything? I fucking want the fucking steak marinara bun. Hey, you want the steak marinara? I want the turkey Hot italiano. Latino. Hot Latina woman, you want anything? Uh, woman. Ch chicken teriyaki. <laughs> hey, I'm oh my god, this you. fucking thing. I just... And yes, I am a Latina. I'm I just... No, 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 no. I just... I imagine... I just imagine Oni getting on one knee to propose, and he says it in the loudest voice ever. No, he'll be like, what I miss? <laughs> <laughs> Yo. Oh, uh, that's dirty. That's dirty, dog. This fucking thing. Oh, my God. I'll miss my own wedding. How in the hell I did that? This does not end. No, if, uh, if you missed our own wedding, I'd have to kill you. <laughs> no, I just... She's waiting impatiently. The, the minister is ready to go. I somehow burst through the door and I just scream out through the entire chapel, WHAT I MISS! <laughs> and, then, and then all of us in RCG do finger guns like, Hey! <laughs> he made it! <laughs> well, by the way, you all are invited. <laughs> Oh, they are. Yeah. Wait. So fucking, fucking better be. Right? 
Dirt. Yeah. Dirt. <laughs> oh! Kurt. Oh! Oh! Ooh, yes! Cur currently in the bit war. Wait. Uh, uh, pure fortune owes, owes zero. You did it. You Woo! saved the world. He did it! I promised you a sub! There you go! There you go! This, this calls for a Kermit yay. Yeah! Oh, no! oh my god, I didn't think you'd actually do it. <laughs> what, you, what, you calling me a fucking liar? I, I don't I'm know. I'm not calling I know, you a truther. I, I, just, oh! I just know you're, uh... I just know you like to save money, so... What well, is a Twitch Prime <laughs> sub? There, but, boom, but, there you go. I was but gonna but use thank you, tracks. thank you both. Yeah. I'm calling you a truther. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, damn it. Now I can finish this stage. Yeah. Oh boy. What's All this right, guy's well, weakness again? What? <laughs> I don't remember. I've lost control of my life. <laughs> Alright. Why is my phone so zoomed in? Okay, here we go. Okay. Why uh, is the light so warm? <laughs> Why am I poisoned? Why am I toxic? <laughs> DSP. <laughs> Fuck you, you fat gout motherfucker. And gout. he's a tea begging piece of shit too. Gout. Yeah, he's got gout. Yep. I didn't. I didn't. I. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. I would insult someone for anything but having gout. <laughs> I, I don't. I gout don't really sucks. Do that, but I get gout. Yeah. Yeah. I, see, I don't do that to Zero because he's my friend. Dark and, Necrobat. And, but. That's a cool one. Dark side Phil. Fuck him. Yeah, I don't I want to. Oh yeah. By the way, Dark Side Phil in a thong. Uh, <laughs> oh, I well, I mean, to be honest, he got caught doing uh, you know what on camera once. So. That's apparently he did it again. So <laughs> he wow. did it again. <laughs> did not learn. Well, oh well, he could just be playing Friday the 13th, and then people in the game will be mocking him for it. That actually happened. Dude smocked him on stream. <laughs> oh, I so would do that. I'd mock him. <laughs> oh, man. I mean, he, he said Smash was number seven, even though he bitched, moaned, and complained about it. That's... <sighs> he bitched, moans, and complains about everything he plays, though. I mean, he bitched, moans, because the sky is blue. <laughs> I mean, when I play Smash, yeah, I suck at it, but I have fun. I have more and then I, I, I drink alcohol, better, and then somehow I get better at playing it. I the most about video games, period. But you're also the best because you beat games in, like, no time. Not with Smash Crummy Online. Don't at me. I don't <laughs> think the online's good. I don't think it's up to snuff. Which is unfortunate, because the rest of the game is fucking incredible. It's my biggest sticking point. The online is alarming. I'm gonna get this game, yeah. but I have never heard yeah, of it. Yeah, but it's not before. nearly as bad as, as Brawl or Wii I'm Ryu. sorry, that doesn't give it a pass. I was actually thinking about this at work, and I'm just like, I know these guys, they're fighting hard against me for this, but I'm just like, I'm sorry. It's not up to the snow. It, it's, it it, there are it. games that are far oh, worse than Smash uh, Ultimates online, so I can't, I can't give it like I can't I say can't that it's. It, I, I I mean, I, I mean it's not perfect, I but know, it's still not in a good. Spot. Let me put it this way: another game that came out around that around that time had worse online problems. In December. Can can you can you think of what in, in holiday season? Can you think of what game I'm thinking of? Easy target. Yeah, but then saying like Smash's online is bad is an easy target too because it's always been kind of then mad at its best. Kind of, then that isn't really a good analysis. I'm sorry. I've only I'm had really bad mad. times with Smash's online when my when a uh, a match room gets overloaded. There's uh you there's a stage that has a lot of shit going on in the background that can be patched out and. When I know he's not here and he's an easy target, but when Blondie's in the room or in the match, those are the only times I have trouble. So I don't know where you're having issues. 
it just doesn't feel good to play compared to, like, any other aspect of Smash. Like, well, it's, it's, a, it's a problem, and I'm not going to neglect it. This doesn't mean the game's bad. Me saying online's not good doesn't mean the game sucks or is worse than Melee. It's far better than Melee. Like, Anyways, let's bad. let's drop it, because it's not important. Um, Ex no, sorry, say that again? It's not important I, I, right now, because I completed the guy armor, and I'm going to shoot this thing into the... I wish I knew what that meant. <laughs> He's going to shoot his load all over Sigma oh, Space. Oh, Zero's going to shoot. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Damn! Damn, son! I'm rocketing into the Eurasia. I like how I loaded it, I load this game up for the first time in like weeks, and it's already telling me that something's wrong with my, my um. Something's wrong with the G diffuser. It's okay. How much you want that hill? Why? Why have I have not heard anyone talk about Starlings? Okay. Well, I played a little bit of it. That's about it. I almost picked it up on Black Friday when it was like thirty bucks with the Star Fox thing. I didn't because I wanted other things. I mean, I kind of want to play it more, but uh. RE2 is very soon, and outside of that, I'm mostly trying to get footage for stuff. All right, guys. It seems like hunkering down on new games. Z okay, Zero Zero's uh, launched the uh, shuttle. Let's see what happens. All right. Let's see how this. Let's see how you mess this up. Will this give me my usual result, or? <clears throat> or... I've gotten I've gotten better results starting on the right side. Uh, then with the with the laser, then starting uh, starting with the original floor. Okay, here we go. You can do it. You can do it all night long. <laughs> you your long time. Oh. Don't believe in yourself. Believe in the me who believes in you. Uh. I, I believe the children are our future. Oh, wait, no, I don't. <laughs> We're screwed. This generation's pretty, uh... yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <gasps> <laughs> yep. Did it. Zero, you did it. You magnificent bastard. <laughs> you saved the world. Shut up, X, I'm alright. Are you okay? Come out. But but zero. <laughs> zero, are you okay? Are you okay, zero? Here, zero. Let me get your arm. It falls off a lot. <laughs> come on, come on, X. Yeah. Show me your move. This is happening. <laughs> what happened? I learned. No, I was not. No. Point eleven F five six four six. <laughs> So now the Sigma virus has evolved into the Zero virus. Man, I hope that I'm not gonna leave Zyke. I'm playing some Nautica like, right now. I'm right here. Well, guys, I think this is where the stream's gonna stop. Uh, when we come back on Thursday, I will do my back tracing, and we will take He's on. Back traced the... it. We will take on the Sigma stages. Um, so thanks for watching. And as far as I'm concerned, the hardest part of the game's over. So <laughs> getting that armor piece. Whew. But uh, but yeah. So we'll, next time we'll come back here and we'll uh, yeah we'll get the we'll do some back tracing and then we'll go do Sigma like I said. So. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you on Thursday at 8.30 p.m. Eastern Time. Anybody have anything they want to say before I finish the stream? Eat no, vegetables? Um, is advertising allowed? I don't understand how this works. Yeah, you're allowed. <laughs> oh, uh, before my, I my finish, stream Wednesday. who's live right now? What? Oh, Who is no live? I'm live I'm right now. I'm just kidding. Seconds. I'm about to be in five seconds. <laughs>
That's let not how. Let me just that's not back. how it works, Saudi. <laughs> I mean, I'm about to we're steal all alive. We're all alive. Let's see. I'll, I'll just say, um, uh, my Wednesday stream tomorrow might be later in the night. I've got work. I don't know when I'll be home. I'm hoping so, nine is a good starting point. If not, it'll be a late ten start stream. So well, Deco is live. So, should we raid Deco? Yeah. All right. All right. Let's see. I think I spelled that right. All right. All right, guys. See you on Deco's stream. Yeah.